previously on Commander Versus. Last week was Alphabet Soup Week, and the budget for our show allowed for exactly one can of generically branded Alphabet Soup to be opened and its letters distributed amongst all four players. And we were to build decks using card names that only started with the letters we were given. Now, I was able to get off to a fast start with one of my partner commanders, Rayhan, laying the beat down early and often, which, uh, as we see here, Jeremy not taking very well and stealing the first of my two commanders. Now, I set the table up to where if they were to give me counters on my creatures, I would not attack them. And in a shocking twist, Jeremy and John refused to listen to that, and thus I attacked them for the entirety of the game. For the first time ever, Steven was the one that followed directions. Jeremy, being the extremely nice person that he is, decided to take my second commander, Isha, multiple times. Anyway, through the entirety of the game, creatures died, boards were swept, decree of pains were painly decreed upon, and ultimately, I was able to get back in the game by casting a shy four times, getting me a bonus point for my commander. Now, wait, wh what do you mean I don't get a point? I had to cast both of my partners four times for a point? Jeremy and Steven get a point? Because they cast their one commander four times? Who made this rule? And, and just to remind you guys, we do want to show you how we're accruing these points every single week. Uh, for the for for these episodes, since we have two journals, we want to make sure that for the casting a general four more times or not casting a general, those count for each of them. So to make sure that we don't lose a point, we have to cast each of our journals one time. And to get the bonus point, got to cast it four more. Anyway, moving on. John calls me a coward for attacking Jeremy with all of my creatures uh, and decides to not take care of his Neverl's disc. But fortunately, Steven, continuing to be the hero of the story, decides to repay John in kind with a lava lanch for lethal to his general face and board area. Now that left myself, Jeremy, and Steven, where we duked it out, but somehow an Atarka continued to sweep Jeremy's board, probably because he didn't want to put more counters on my creatures and or steal my commander. Jeremy was not able to survive, getting punched out by Steven coming to the punch club one week late. It didn't last much longer there as Steven was able to overwhelm me with Lithoform Engine, finally giving out his third L of the evening as promised. This is where we stand for points on the season. And this week, we are returning to the Coliseum of Randomness, doing something that we have done previously. Come closer. Closer still. Closer still. We're doing hidden rolls. So with hidden rolls, each player was randomly assigned a role given by director Kyle. Now, each of these roles, if we complete them before the end of the game, are going to be worth one point each. They vary in difficulty, and I'm sure he's played favorites, but we won't necessarily know that until we see what everyone's roles are. So, let's see how everyone has built their deck for the hidden role they were given. So this week our theme is hidden roles, and Kyle was obviously very lazy once he got around to mine because it's simply deal lethal damage with Fibble Fib. Uh, now, that could be commander damage, it could be someone's last few life points, so I'm going to be playing some counter spells and some defensive spells like a mono blue player would, uh, along with some equipment to try and pick and choose my spots to hopefully chip away uh, at some damage with my commander, but I don't really foresee the guys being fooled by what's going on. Uh, there's not very many creatures in my deck. The ones that are basically value creatures, so I think once they see a giant sword appear and Fibblefip get equipped, they're going to kind of pick up on what's going on, but hopefully we can make it work anyways. For this episode, my secret role is to bring four cards back from Exile. Originally, I was just going to play a blink deck, but then Director Kyle was just like, no, that's not in the spirit of what the uh, role is supposed to be. So instead, I'm going to play Morophon the Boundless and play a five-color colorless Eldrazi deck. Now, the deck is going to be, be mostly cards from Battle for Zendikar because there were a lot of Eldrazi that would allow you to exile cards from your opponent's 
hands and libraries and things like that. And then there were the processors, which allowed you to take cards from your opponent's exile and put them into their graveyard for an effect. Now, we're going to try and get to the goal by using that effect throughout the game. My hidden role is to equip a creature with six or more equipment. So for this, I chose Bromance. Can you arrest us? We're going to be broing it up today. And uh, we're going to be using a plethora of swords in our armory. Uh, we're going to be using any aid we can get to get those cards out. And last but not least, which is very important, winter is coming. And it's only appropriate that I go last with my deck tech, presumably if Kyle has done his job correctly, and that my hidden role is to determine the hidden roles of the other players before they're revealed. Now, this did give me a lot of options for deck building, so I went with webcam favorite, Sin Triplets. My goal is to ultimately use political leveraging throughout the entire course of the game to find out what everyone else's hidden roles are. I have a bunch of ways to do it, maybe taking people's turns, maybe using their own cards against them, but ultimately, I need to find out what those roles are by any means necessary. Now, right. just why are you going to go first? Or, oh, that was Jeremy. Jeremy, why do you get to go first? Uh, probably because I'm in last place. That's fine. However, there's no reason that I'm going last. Other we're than going, the fact uh, that I, I, we're going last together. Here, okay, uh, we're taking a turn at the same time. We'll, no, we'll say it's, no. Jeremy, why don't you just go on? With I'm going to play my path of ancestry and pass the turn. We're going right, to say right. it's because you're uh, so good that you need, you know, to I'll play a swamp and say go. No, go I'm last. not. I'm not playing with a handicap. Okay, we're not doing that. Oh, we're taking our turn at the same time, right? No. You you get to watch my turn. Are you ready? I'm done. Well, yeah. Well, he well, he gets to watch your turn every turn. That's how it goes. Listen, yeah. I'm, all right. Go. I'm magnifying it this time. Okay, he has to watch my every move. Oh boy, gonna pay so too much time and play this arcane signet. Oh, I, I think turn. you got Malcolm excited. He's wagging back there. <laughs> he did. He he went to puppy play care today, so he was very excited. It's a good uh, day. It's a good day for Malcolm. It is a good way, day for Malcolm. Now, how does so do they have a play turn, care though. for for Stevens? Okay. Like Steven play care? Do they have a Steven play care? I believe yeah, that do. it's called the bar. And those are pretty, pretty, pretty yeah, close. Those are, those are close. That's I'm going to yeah. play the, an island in a fall war stone. All right, then you're done? I'm done. Oh, man. What a heater. Yeah, he what went to puppy play care. And the uh, marble diamond. <laughs> and the woman that... Uh, that got him out when uh, when we came to pick him up was like, oh yeah, he's so full of energy. Like even when all the rest of the dogs were taking a nap, he was just weaving in between them all. Yep, I'm yeah. sure that's he's... how mine is when he goes. Yeah, you should say, like, yeah, he's a weaver. <laughs> all right, I'm losing a life to polluted delta, getting an island. Then I'm gonna cast fibble fip to draw a card. See, uh, right out the gate. Now he's trying to get first blood. Yep. Hey, here I am. So if we if it just becomes the target, um, any old spell or ability. However, that gives me nine. No, 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 cards. just spells. Or eight cards, eight cards, and I have to discard. Discard a card. Well, he doesn't come out of my hand, and he draws me a card. So, yep. Um, sure, I'll discard. I don't think any of you are going to have a a haste creature, so I'll discard Pongify. Well, even if we were John, you don't have the mana for Pongify. Listen, you don't know what I have. <laughs> but how good could his hand be that he ditched a pocket fire? I have, I have. There are only two effects in blue, and he pitched one of them. <laughs> I might have Fairy Spirit Guide. You don't know. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. Uh, I will pass the turn. Play Eldrazi Temple, pass the turn. Eldrazi Temple, wait, you say. Wait. Is your... Is your... Tribe Eldrazi? Maybe. Sure. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play another Swamp. Eldrazi Temple points to that. And I'm going to play a Windborn Muse Ooh. off of John's Plains and Jeremy's Five uh, Mile Land. I don't have a plane. Uh, Steven's Plains. Okay. I'm done. Mm. Only islands here. And 
Ancestry. utility lands. Jeremy's got a path of ancestry, so this yeah. Felwar stone makes it all. It does it all. Play a flagstones. Ooh, look at you. We'll play a cult still heart. We'll call white. And we'll play winter order. Whew. Fun. All right, I'm going to tap this island. Now, um, yep. Windborn uses just you, Steve, Justin, right? I have, only if I attack you. Hey, you can attack anyone else. Wait, right. Winter Orb? That's what no. he said. Yeah. Mm. Do you down to that? Did you need to do something about that before I uh, proceed? Uh, yes, before that? you proceed, I'm going right. to spell shrivel that. Counter target right. spell unless it's controlled oh, phase four. Exile it. If it's a countered, exile it. All right, I want to tap both my islands then instead of one. Yep. But it's okay. I'm not really going to do anything with them. I'm going to play uh, Rogue's Passage. And uh, Steven, because you tried to play Winter Orb, which I love, I'm going to go ahead and attack Jeremy. Okay. Because he stopped one. it. He stopped it, yeah. Go ahead. Oh, man. I, I love, love Winter that. Orb. Yeah. I was trying to play the Winter Orb game. Are you ready, man? Artifacts to play? Yeah, I was ready. Yeah. Dustin, if you'd have had a Frostbringer, I would have fought the yeah. Counter War back. Man, mm. Justin, Justin really appreciates that counter spell. Oh, I know he does. Versus what? why, Howard? Because oh, it might have slowed you down. I have, a, I have a Windborn Muse in on the battlefield. Yeah. Be, that would just be no one would attack me for the rest of the game. Well, I don't want to attack you until Windborn Muse had an accident. That's fine. <laughs> is, it, is that an Urza's Tower? It is an Urza's Tower. What? He's trying to cast that morph on three lands. I'm not sure I like what Jeremy's up to. He's already countered my spell. I now think he's playing Urza's Tower. I think. I think. Oh, well, I'm, let, let's see. Actually, I don't even do that. He. What do you he think? Spell shriveled me. I don't know. I don't know. I don't right. know what I think. I'm gonna play Ruination Guide. Devoid ingest three two. Other colorless creatures you control get plus one plus zero. Very nice. I'm going to go ahead and uh, say that you're probably playing a tribal Eldrazi deck. I yeah, might be. That's my I might guess. be. And then Path of Ancestry says, Scry. It shares Scry 1. Ooh. It's changeling. I think J Jeremy has to cast 20 Devoid cards. Devoid 20 spells. Devoid cards? That's a lot. I, I think that's what he has to do. That is not a very fair. That's not fair compared to what I have to do. Maybe it's 25. <laughs> I'm going to put that on. Now, that Winter Orb is exiled currently, isn't it? I don't necessarily. I, I mean, I guess I don't know what you have to do, but like, judging from what I had to do, like, it seems pretty reasonable. I'm going to 25 pass. Devoid cards? I thought you said 25. 20, 20, 20 or 25? I don't know. I'm just. I don't know, just man. I'm just. Throwing out a number. Yeah, it makes sense. I, I'd be wait, willing just, to wager that uh, most games of Commander don't see a player cast 20 spells. Well, well this one no. might. Jeremy's already cast three. He's most of the way there. That's true. Not, well, I guess the colorless artifacts are, yeah. Uh, I like attacking. Um, uh, don't blame you. I'll attack you, John. Yeah. Well, I'm not going to attack Jeremy after well, he got no, You're not going to attack the guy who tried the win Winter Orb. I got it. I'll take the two. Uh, I, like I said, no, I didn't actually care fine. if Winter Orb was there. Yeah. Well, I got it. I can't blame him for not caring. You, you, Stephen, you, about you seconds ago, you tried to blame me for not care for caring. You were like, you were like, you, Matt, we're in orbs gonna hurt you now. No, it wasn't there. I, I said, you're probably your happy. Impression. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna play Sin Triplets, who's my commander. I don't like where this is not fun at all. S says the person who tried to cast Winter Orb. Anyway, I'm done. So, uh, the beginning of your upkeep, you choose an opponent player can't play spells or activated abilities on your turn, basically. Play yeah. with their hand revealed and you can cast oh, cards. Okay. I was like, who are you talking to, man? I'm not doing Ooh. any of that. So they just can't cast spells on my turn when I target them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and just see it. You know what's cool about it with Sent Triplets? It doesn't do much against the Mono Blue deck. <laughs> and and guess, that's does, not necessarily true. It doesn't make your spells uh, uncounterable. It does make my spells uncounterable. It does make your spells uncounterable. Bremaz. Yep. Mm-hmm. And then I'm gonna cast um, Swift Foot Boots and ooh. attempt to equip. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't like that. Brimaz is fine, but Swift Foot Boots stinks. Let's uh, let's respond in impulse. Is that cool? Yeah. All right. Threw that Pongify I mean, away. Well, I mean, he just recast it, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Ooh, these are good cards. 
but what's the best one? Uh, they're all very good cards. I would trade my hand for these four cards. Um, wow. Yeah, it's a, it's good. I think I'm just going to take this one. Uh, okay. Cool, Steven, you good? Jeremy, how big is your creature? 3-2. Three, 3-2? Two. Three, two? Yeah, 3-2. Um, three two. Three two. I got three. Since triplets is a three three. Two. Sure. Since triplets could be a oh one. You wouldn't block, is what you're saying. You can't attack me, so I'm not gonna have to block. Oh, that's sure. true. The wind warned me. So it's just John and Jeremy. Okay, what's well, gotta be John? Also, I get a little, a little. No, yeah, John takes four. Yeah. Now that one one can attack anybody. Can it? Does it? Can it? Yeah, just in the play with attacking. You don't even have to pay for Windworm Moose. Uh, uh, yeah. sure, sure, sure. I get you attack me, Steven. Go, go ahead. No, I'm good. I'm going to not do that. Is this real? Is what real? You don't got CAC token? Of course oh, it's real. Oh, there are these. Okay, okay. I, was, I don't have... One. Ah, yes. The Brainstorm yeah. Cats. Yeah, the Brainstorm Cats are 1-1 one, one Vigilance Cat Soldiers. Uh, yep. you're a... So that one also went to John? Yes. Well, yeah. I can't imagine four, it went anywhere else. Yeah, yeah, four yeah. total went to John? Yeah, I'll play a prismatic vista and uh, leave my my fibble fit back to the, do the blockings. Go ahead. Hmm. And four mana open, no big deal. Four mana. In your just enough for factor fiction. Urza's mine. Oh boy, that's two of those. Sure is. Don't think I have a way to really go grab the other one that I can think of off the top of my head, but. One, well, two, three. Look at you playing Tron, you'll just draw it naturally. Seven. Probably. I'm gonna play more fun. Alright. And I'm going to name Eldrazi shocked. No. Eldrazi. Shocked. So now it's a uh, a four three? You're a ruination guy? This is a four three, and this is a seven six. Yes. Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh and then I will uh Man, I'm not I'm just gonna, gonna crack this vista while you're doing your thing and lose a life. Can't swing at Justin. Not nope. gonna swing at Steven. Yep, I'm so over here still. We'll we'll swing Ruination Guide at the guy with four open mana. Sure, I'll take it. And I will pass the turn. All right. I'm going to my turn on my upkeep. So I have to I have to choose a choose target opponent. Now, Jeremy, I mm -hmm. feel like. <laughs> the most powerful cards. Well, no, I feel like I feel like his role is to cast colorless creatures or devoid cards or something like that. Colorless non-artifact cards, something like that. Yeah. So I feel like if I target Jeremy and I can cast it out of his hand, that will make him not be able to prevent his role. However, I'm willing to make you a deal. This is it? Look, this is an easy deal. Okay. I will target a, a, another person with this if you just tell me what your role is. Just oh, so I, I just want to know. Dude, no. Oh. You, you want to tell me publicly? Just text it to me. Oh, Jeremy! How, oh my goodness! Yeah, it's it's just I'm just trying to make a deal. Okay? No not, way. Not risking that now. What do you mean not risking it? All right. Well, you well, no, to be fair, Justin, it is a risk because once you know it's roll, whether it's dead then, or not, you can then, actively mess with it. Yeah, then you can mess with it. But I'm with you now. And I feel the reason I'm offering you this is I feel like I'm close. <laughs> and I know and you know that I am. You know he, that I am. He smells that Vincer. He smells a bit. Yeah, I feel like I'm close. So if you just if you if you tell me I will not target you with central blitz at all. And if I don't tell you? Then I'm going. Then I'm going to. You go ahead and do that thing. Target you with sin triplets. Do what you need to do. I'm All right, I'm going to target you. All right, I'm going to target you with sin triplets. All right, that player uh, cannot activate uh, abilities or cast spells, and you have to play with your hand revealed this turn. On your turn, right? Yeah, right, right now. And then I can I can play lands and. Oh boy! <laughs> Good oh, lord. Boy. Okay. Um, so I have Kinder okay, Dominance. The card is? Okay, Kinder Kinder Dominance, Dominance okay. Ball of Dust, Titan's Presence, and Bajuka Bog. Whew. Good lord. 
Okay. I am. So I'm sorry, I'm gonna, can you cast Titan's Presence without a? No. No, I have to. Okay. Well, okay. I would have to do. I would have to do both sides of it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna play that Bajuka Bog though. So you're gonna play this on your side? Yeah. He okay. now has a Bajuka Bog. You don't. It's just over here. It's in his play. It's in his side of the board. Whose graveyard are we at? Right John. Now? I'm talking John's. Yeah. Obviously. I don't have one. So I didn't think I was you were gonna target. Targeting me. anyway. Should have targeted Steve Jeremy's. He's over there ingesting. Yeah. Well, he, he has an attempt to ingest. Yeah. Did he manage to ingest? Oh, John, did you ingest? It doesn't matter. He's I didn't have anything exiled. That's not what ingest does. When he does damage, uh, you exile the top card of your library. Yeah, sorry. Whenever this creature deals combat damage to a player, that player exiles the top card of his or her library. I did not. I will do that right now. Here it comes. Here it comes. Yeah, you're thinking about that other ability that moves cards out of exile. That's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah. That's, uh, it's not digest, it's, uh, or what? ingest. Is it, that card's exiled too, right? Whatever he Yeah, it's exiled. All right, All right, I'm gonna play Luminarch Ascension. Oof. Uh, that's a messed up card. I'm gonna, I'm gonna unwind that. Should've, should've picked John. Okay. You said, I told you, you can't cast my spells, but... You can get your your spells are uncounterable. I'm gonna take on for five. All right, I'll block whatever the the biggest thing Three. is. Three. The commander damage. Yeah. Sure. All right. Uh, I can't cast any more spells from Jeremy's hand, so I'm done. You can pick your hand back up, Jeremy. Hmm. Now I've got my pants down for the world to see. Well, you you could have had your pants up. You could do is just send me a picture you, of your pants, you Jeremy. You could have chosen either other person as well. True. And your spell probably would have resolved. Well, so really, that's you only true. have yourself to blame. That you're making a strong case. Here's here's a Malcolm. All right, John. If I attack you, don't you try to trick me with Malcolm, Jeremy? I'm listening. It's working. If you attack me, what? Well, I want to put a sword on something, but then you'd have to take a bigger hit. So I think this is bad. All I'm going to gain is destroying an artifact. So it's not very powerful. I don't think you probably want to. I mean, that. I'm trying can, to decide. Uh, can you put a sword on something and attack Justin and destroy his send triplets? That'd be sweet. Um, no, I can attack you. He's got Sword of Sinew and Steel, is what he's yeah. saying. Yeah. I'm just okay. going to play Sword of Sinew and Steel. Okay. Now, what does that say? It says whenever a quick creature does combat damage to a player, destroy up to one target planeswalker and one target artifact. Now, if you, put that on, if you want to put that on your 1-1, one, one, I'm cool with it. You can re-equip it to your Red Miles afterwards. No, I can't. I have three mana. You don't need pro black and red. No one's playing those colors. I will equip it to my 1-1. One, one. Mm. All right. I will go to attackers, and I will just attack you, John, with this lone 3-3. Three, three. You're, uh, you're not attacking with Brimaz? Nope. I'll go ahead and take the three, Steven. Triggers. I will shoot sin triplets in the face. Pew pew. Unbelievable. I have to agree. That was very mean of me. And then I am done. All right, Steven. Since you're being so kind, I'm going to choose you with my factor fiction. Oh. You don't have to be crazy with it. Just, just make it good. Ooh. All right. Snapcaster Mage. Agent of Treachery, Strip Mine, Sunken Hope, and Imperial Plate. He definitely has to win with Bethel Tip. Imperial Plate, it's like screaming that. I tell you what, Imperial Plate's in one pile. Uh, you said Sunken Hope? You familiar with Sunken Hope, Steven? I don't know off the top of my head what it does. Uh, it's an enchantment that says at the beginning of each player's upkeep, they must return a creature they control to their hand. Of course, Kyle will put up the bad art. God, I, I didn't know what is that. Not to be fair, it is not bad. Caster, Sunken Hope, in one pile. The rest of the cards in the other. So we got these and these. Yep. Now I like these, but the truth of the matter is, I actually just there's only them. one. There, look, but the band cards are in the other pile. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. I, I, gave you, I gave you the band cards. Honestly, it was I. I just needed Lance. I I just need Lance. Yeah. All right, done. I am. Yeah. If that would have been a, a double island versus everything else, I probably would have still had to take the double island. Uh, there's a strip mine. Hmm. 
Now, I can't play this Imperial Plate because Steven might go ahead and do something mean to it. I will not. You might, though. Give him a target. I think what? you can play the Imperial Plate. But you might blow it up with your Sword of Sinu. But I could blow up Felwar Song. And... Yeah, but I want my spell war stone now. Well, you couldn't cast white spells if I did that. That's not true. Ooh, I have exotic orchard. exotic orchard. That can only is that only for creatures? Is that right? No, it's no. just what? whatever we. It's fell war stone. It's fell war stone on a Oh, land. okay. It's I thought text. that was the only the exact same text. Yeah, my bad. Well, then my play. So now, here's here's the thing. I really don't like the fact that you guys keep attacking me. Well, you should play something hopes. Well, that would have just made you pick up a creature. Oh, well. That would have been good against the other two people, right? Yeah, I guess. Justin only has one creature, and then Jeremy has to make up a good card. All right, Steven. I'm going to keep leaning into you here. I'm going to go ahead and cast Curse of the Swine. X equals two. Uh, and the targets are going to be Windborn Muse and Morphon. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Justin, Justin, now, now, Justin can be attacked in case anybody wow. didn't know. I think I figured out. I think I figured out John's role. It's be Steven's pawn the whole game. <laughs> Says the guy who sees one every week. <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm done. That. <laughs> That's good. I like that. Yeah, lot. look, Listen, I might, I just don't like yeah, Jeremy, I might, down. John, I might need a pawn, but I'm not a pawn, okay? Uh huh. Exotic orchard. Every week. Oh, I'm not going to attack Steven. I don't want to anger him. Uh, hey, he, he's, he's got his finger on the laugh line there. He knows what's going on. Um, hmm. you're just gonna cast Morphon again now, Jeremy. I did not kill your ingester for you because I felt like that was critical to what you had to do. That's why, yeah. Maybe he's got to some cards and jest some stuff. Well, I couldn't target Brimaz, and there was no reason to target a Sinud creature because that just angers him more. So, yep. <laughs> If you had stepped on my kitten, I would be really mad. <laughs> it's not a step. I upgraded, Steven. It's a 1-1. One, one. I was uh, going to get you a 2, two pig. If you turned my kitten into a pig, I would be pissed. I, I, will, uh, I will. Now, Justin can be attacked now. Don't forget this now. Justin can be attacked, but he has a 2-2 two, two pig to block. My oh, my team. God. Here we go. So I'm going to attack John for three. Oh, Jeremy, what an idiot. You don't want to sacrifice your creature you and your token. Pig? You attack John instead. Ah, oh, that's so dumb. What about the pig is what so the question dumb. The pig, um, pig's hanging out. All right, just sure. Remember, just remember, heavy is the crown, buddy. Heavy is the crown. Like, you have the crown too, Stephen. <laughs> no, 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 you clearly have the crown. You're in that seat. Injured. All right, what do I do? Crown. Exile the top card of your library. And you take three. Yeah, get that land out of there that you need. Yeah. You need I'm going to pass the turn. All right, I'm going to tap my pig. I'm going to play a Temple of Silence and Scry. We'll put that on the bottom. Hmm. I don't really, I really don't know what I want to do here. I'm just going to hang tight and I'll pass the turn. Hmm. Take it around. Well, last time I last time I attacked, it did not work out. <laughs> and that's the difference between you and Jeremy. He's over there attacking, and you're over there blocking. Jeremy now, you specifically see, that's what we call didn't, attack, didn't okay. attack with the same the same token. Uh huh. I'm gonna put a sword of sinew and steel on on the cat. Yeah, on on the cat on, on the kitty cat. Yeah. And then we're going to go to attacker. I'm going to attack Jeremy with Freeman and John with my kitten. Which one? This this one's not attacking, just this one. This you one attack the other vigilant I'll take, creature? I'll take one. I'll block with the boar. Cahoots. Yep. The hell's that? Cahoots. Okay. You need to take John with your vigilant I need, I need a blocker. Vigilance. It's got vigilance. What does something happen in attackers lacking like aetherized? Yeah, I could have that fairy spirit guide. Yeah. Fairy, 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 fairy ritual. 
what ger- is in Jeremy's deck, okay? Fairy ritual. You have no idea what's in my deck. I, I do not. The counterspell you played against me, I've never seen. <laughs> All done. <laughs> I play a Mangara, and I'm done after that. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. You All creatures it. on the bottom, right? Or no. I'm no, sorry. Non, non-land permanence to everyone's hands. Non-land permanence to hands. Boop, 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 boop. Um, but I'm going to play... Take a shit attack with that so you could block with it, Steven. Uh, and then I'm going to cast... I'm going to get three cards for this. I'll have to discard a card. Hmm. I'm going to pay four. Keeping count of how many cards he has to discard. Well, yeah, I, Fibblethip throws the math off, man. Yeah. All right, I'll cast Fibblethip. <laughs> <laughs> throws the math off. I'll, I'll cast it. That I way. have seven. I'm good. All right, go ahead. I guess I should okay. get the extra dice ready for the old Fibblethip. <sighs> Uh, I'll pay two for that uh, arcane signet again. Hey, there it is. It's back. Um, hmm. That is interesting. <laughs> it is interesting. Interesting indeed. All right, so I'll pay three. Cast that ruination guide again. There it is. Yeah, oh, man, tricked us. I did. Thought he was going to for sure have something else. Uh, and then I will pass the turn. All right. Untap. All right. I'm going to play an ex- uh, a forbidden orchard to go hey. along with an exotic orchard. Mm. So you, are you saying that you're like a, a grower? Yeah, no, I think his uh, hidden role is to control every orchard. <laughs> Good news, I'm two thirds away there. I think. I get monopoly on orchards. Let's see. I'm I'm just going to cast uh, some triplets again. Uh, Jeremy, you can have a a one one a colorless spirit one one Without colorless flying. spirit that doesn't fly. Kamigawa spirit. Doesn't well, fly. Justin, you know how excited are you that we might be going back to Kamigawa? You know what? Uh, it actually uh, seems pretty cool. Yeah. This one says flying, but we're going to pretend it doesn't have flying. Yeah. And that gets plus one, plus one, Jeremy, right? Uh, it's it plus, plus one, plus O. Plus one, plus okay. O. Good. Well, this is no good. I'm Steven, you put Brimaz in your hand, right? Not into yeah, your command I'm going to play these two. And All right. I have eight cards, and I'm very thankful for that. I'm going to discard... Oof. <laughs> Oof. Eldrazi could script. Really? Well, well. If, if Justin chooses me for whatever reason and magically makes a land drop, it'll go badly for us. True. So we're just not, we're, we're we, nope. Not, not going to risk that. it. Can't do that <laughs> one. So, it's a good old nope. He can get, he can easily get a swift foot bits or a sword of Sidhu and steel. I guess my commander, a Mangara, yeah. or a bunch of stuff I can't cast. Central um, is a 3-3, three, three, right? It is. 3-3. Yeah, so everyone at the table take note of my willingness to save us for this. Okay? Steven, su- such a such it's a, a noble sacrifice, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's do four. Let's play Key John Archive. Mm-hmm. Let's play that plate. There it is. Cost three to equip, right? Two, two to equip. Two and two. Two and two. Okay. Fifth tip. Get on it. Uh. Uh, Justin. How much? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'll take seven. All right. Wow. I'll play a land. It's now six six, and I'll be done. John's roll is. Definitely deal, yeah. deal, deal yeah. lethal commander damage with with I, yep. I have to believe that it is. It's a definitely. It's definitely that. I'm confident of it. Man, if only you would have all listened to my deck tech. 
Well, we, we, <laughs> we didn't know. I know. Hmm. The thing is, it's general cost almost no mana, so it's so hard to take him off of his plan. <laughs> well, you guessed it. Now it officially costs six. Um. No, it already has nine. I don't really want. I have nine. This to happen, so. Uh. Because are you are you going to target me with this centrist no. again? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. Because like, he's going to target me this time. No, no, no. The re- Jeremy, in all seriousness, I know the majority of the cards in your hand, and I do not want to cast them. Yeah, they're not good for you, which is why I'm like. Yeah, so I'm not going to cast would, them. Why would you want to do that? But I don't. I don't want to do it. Um. Yeah, I'm just going to swing it, to John, for another three and just. Yeah, exile the top card of that library. Oh, yeah. Another land. Get that land uh, out of there. I'm going to pass the turn. All right. I'm going to untap. I have Centriplet Trigger. Steven, you have a lot of cards I can cast from your hand. Yep. I'm going to make you the same deal as Jeremy. Uh, he's yep. just showing them right now. I'm just show them to you. I'm he's not making the deal. Talking. All right. <laughs> not, you're not taking the deal? Of course not. All right, show me your hand. Same deal so, I made, Jerry. So, so many. Is that mass, mass, oh, mass calcify? I'm sure it's all non-white uh, creatures, okay. which is convenient for him because Sin Dribbles is white. It sure is. Yeah. Cost seven, though, or six? He, he has seven, yeah. Cost yeah. seven. Yeah. I'm not going to cast that, though. No. Like, for sure no, not going to cast it. Of course it. not. Okay, uh, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to play a uh, a Felwar Stone. Mm-hmm. And the sword, the sword is three. All right, I'm going to play uh, Brimaz. Man, hands. he just played your commander, Steven. Jeez. I mean, he's going to play my whole hand. He's a, well, he's not going to your whole hand, but he's a 3-4. Three, 3-4. Four. Three, four. You, you should have been able to cast one spell on my hand. This is shenanigans. <laughs> what? I, I could have cast no spells. That would have been up to you. No, I'm saying you should only be able to cast... Uh, yeah, you. I'm saying you could have made it so I cast none, though. No, no. Nope. Uh, and then I'm going to give... Um, Steven, I'll give you a, a one one colorless spirit token. And then I'm gonna cast uh, a sword of sinew and steel. Steven, look at all the stuff you gave him. I mean way to help the board, I guess, John. I'm trying. Didn't look that turn did not look like you were trying at all. Uh, I devastation tied and I killed their creatures. I said okay? that turn. I don't think that I got one of those stupid industry base. This my. Um, All right. You're not catching the rest of this, right? No, I'm done. I'm done after that. Hmm. That's concerning. Oh, wait. Sorry. I have sent triples. I'll attack John for three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Steven's turn. <laughs> John's at 13. Yeah, you guys yeah. attacked literally only me the entire game. You notice your life totals. I believe I blocked with a creature, so... I'm just saying attacking-wise. I'll play... It's only been over here, and then me attacking. I'll play Mangara, and I'm actually going to leave my strip mine up in case... I'm done. Done? Yep. How can I not die is the real question. Make some blockers? See, here's the thing, Steven. I'm playing a mono blue deck without a lot of creatures, so there's not a lot of them in my deck. Yeah, his hidden roll isn't kill people with other creatures. It's kill Plenty people with other creatures. In mono blue, for you to put some, some, some creatures in. I think there's plenty of ways. Well, you got every colorless Probably. way. Every colorless way. Lands, um, maybe two lands that do it. Um, I don't think you really need islands or anything other than you played them. Like, I mean, islands you What does Mangara say? It says, um, 
Whenever an opponent attacks with creatures, if two or more of those creatures are attacking you or points which you control, draw a card. Whenever an opponent casts their second spell each turn, draw a card. Second spell. Mm -hmm. Second. Two of them. Two spells. Yeah, I gotcha. Well, the, the turn it was in play, John cast two spells, but one of them was just tied first. One of them was what? Devastation tied. And you cast it first. Mm, yeah. That was good. All right, I'm going to play. I guess I'm just going to attack first. Makes the most sense, right? Sure. All right. Uh, That's what you need to do. Justin, I'll make you give Steven his block. rhythm as back. I'll block. Yeah. I'll get I'll get a little cat. Get a little little one one. Yeah. That's also blocking. I think I'm gonna, then, I'm, then I'm gonna kill. Does it have to block? Well, I don't, I don't pretty know. sure. Pretty sure it does. Blocking that creature, yeah. yeah. Block. Mine mine's bigger. Can't confirm. Uh so you block with four power worth? Yes. So I'm just gotta be careful I don't drop too many cards. Um, play Academy Runes. No, that's a combo. What's a combo? Can you draw an archive of Academy Runes? What's the combo? I, I guess it's a combo. It's a real expensive combo. For, for a million mana, draw one new card. Uh, so that's five. We'll do what Steven said and make a blocker. With Monomic Wall. That's very smart. Monomic Wall. Ba, 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 da, da. Um. Can't ingest it anymore. It's a 1 1, right? What? It's a 1 1. Yeah, yeah, one, yeah, one, yeah, yeah. Um. JD? Oh, I had a JD. Yep. I'll pick up Devastation Tide. That seems like the most safe option. All right, I am done. I will flash in vile redeemer. So vile. Uh, when it when I cast it, I can pay a colorless. If I do put a one one Eldrazi Scion creature token on the battlefield for each. Oh, I thought that was just non creature token that died. Yeah. Non creature token that died. Okay, well, whatever. I just non token it. non token creature. Yep, it's a. Th Hold on, let me let me read that real quick. Okay, so that didn't do quite what I thought it did, but whatever. That's fine. I Flashed, and now you can attack me for even more. Yeah, now I have a 3-3. Three, three. Uh, so I will... Well, I'm going to... Because I used Path of Ancestry with that, so I'm going to scry one first. Does that count as the second spell? No. No, it was... I only cast spell. this one. Yeah, well, the second one got cast, but it wasn't his second. Yeah. Yeah, it's not... Mm, no, I don't want that. I not, the, it's not the way. I need you to cast the two spells on Draw the for my turn. That's a pretty good one. Pretty, pretty good one, he says. Pretty good. I heard him say it. How good is it? Well, one, two, three, four, five, and uh -oh. six <laughs> is going to be Endbringer. That's a good one. You were right. Uh, I'm going to scry. You know, I've been sitting here thinking, and I have a feeling that Justin's role might be able to play with our cards because he chose. You, th cards. you think control X amount of cards? Many, I don't know how many though. How many? Um, like how many permits it is to set it off? It's not. Yeah, Stephen was just or Justin just felt like playing the big card that steals everybody else's cards. It's true. Yeah. I want to play with Sindril, but I want to know what Jeremy felt like every every week for the last six months. <laughs> yeah, yep. I mean, like, look, I've been playing some Among Us, so you're suspect, Justin. That's all I've got to say. Like, uh, we'll go six at Justin because he doesn't have blocker right now. I'll take it. Um, seven. And then I will. Is it seven? Uh, it's. Yeah, it's seven because this is a four one. Yep, you're right. And then in just one, so exile one from the top. Oh, exile. Oh, fractured identity. See, that would have been good for oh, everybody. Yeah, that would have been interesting. Uh, and then I will pass the turn. We would have all got inbringers. Is what he's saying. Hold on. Yep. Hold on. All right. Which... I'm I'm tapped. I'm just not going to retap them. Yeah. Do the Steven. Well, that's yeah. 
I, right, I know. At the, at the end of Jeremy's turn, I'm going to cast Evacuation. Okay. Yeah. Return now, creatures. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold okay, on, okay, hold okay. On. We have to hold on again. Just so what are you going to do with that centrip? What's on your turn? Nothing, because he's casting Evacuation. It'll be in my hand, so... Then what if it wasn't in your hand? Oh. Uh, that depends if John's tapped out or not. I am tapped out, yes. He looks tapped out. But he's been talking about having that fairy spirit guide for so long. Sure. It's also just called Force of Will, all right? I'm not going to get a better chance at this. I'm going to mana (laughs) time. Okay. (laughs) Not going to get a better chance at this. Steven, I'm not going to pick you, even if I was before, just on account of mana time. Yeah, that's so... uh, Thank you, mana time. Man. Now you're up, Justin. All right, I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick. Uh, I'm gonna offer it to John, but I'm gonna offer him the same deal as everybody else. What's the deal? All That's you have to do you. is just tell me your hidden roll. You don't tell everyone else. Just tell me. Well, how do I just tell you? You just text it to me. No, John. Oh, he's texting. John. Okay, Jeremy. I'll All choose right. you. You go ahead and play this uh, Winds of Abandon if you really want, because the other three are, you already knew. Oh, I'm definitely gonna play Winds of Abandon. All right. I'll uh, draw a card for my turn. Okay. John, John, John. You're the one who manatized me, Steven. You could have just picked up your Mangara and recast it next turn. <laughs> no, manatized will be set in my hand later. I he has more cards that cost a million mana. You would have gotten I needed to get somebody. He can no, already did. cast more fun, right? I already cast it once, yeah. It costs nine next time I want to play it. Yeah, you think you can't mana tie the nine cast the cost card? Well, he's two mana off. No, he's... he's... It's cool. I'm, I get I'm it. one mana off. Yeah, because El Drazi Temple gives you... What, is, you, you what, is, is that, what does Titan's Resolve say? Titan's, Titan's Presence, presence as an additional presence. cost to cast Titan's Presence, reveal a colorless creature card from your hand. Exile target creature card if its power is less than or equal to the revealed creature's power. <laughs> That card does. <laughs> <laughs> that card does nothing. I'm gonna cast Titan's Presence. I'm gonna reveal this Worm Coil engine I just drew. Nice. I'm gonna I'm gonna target Endbringer. Okay. That's that's super convenient. Why is that Winds of Abandon gone? Oh, I'm gonna, don't worry. I'm gonna cast that Winds of Abandon. I'm gonna target Fibblethip. This one. So what does Winds of Abandon say? Uh. uh it doesn't, it doesn't matter. It, 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 it says target creature, so... Yeah, this okay, one is so target. targeting makes this shuffle in, which I'm not going to do. I'm just going to pop them right over here. Actually, if I shuffle, I get a land, don't I? If you shuffle it no, in... No, you, no, no. Wait, it, it fails to revolve. It fails to yeah. revolve. Yeah, all right. To the exile. All right. Um... I think I am going to just hang out. Why? What's up with my sword? Why'd you take it if you aren't going to equip it? Because he's got things to do with his mana. I want, yeah, I got things to do. Can I have it back? Maybe. No, Wait, I have a way to give it back. Hold on, hold on. You cast two spells, right? I did. Okay. I'm gonna... Yeah. My oh, general. There he is. No. General Kitty. You're up, John. All right. Hey, oh. It's an island. Well, 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 well. <laughs> Justin has a million cards, and he left three mana open of any color. Yeah. I we have... know he has a worm coil engine. How many cards do you have? I have, f- I have six. I have five unknowns six. and a worm coil. Five unknowns in a worm coil. Yeah, that's a lot. It is a lot. It's too many. It is simply too many. All right, let's start things off with, let's just see what our options are. I'm going to cast Manifold Insights. Oh, boy. So I reveal the top 10 cards in my library. Mm -hmm. And then starting with the next opponent in turn order, each of you chooses a non-land card to put to my hand. So one... Two, three, four, five, seven, seven, eight, nine, ten. So starting with uh, Jeremy. Vincer. Bobble. I get Bobble. Okay. Justin. Don't you dare, Justin. Don't you dare. I'll choose... uh, Is that Dreamstone Archive? The big six-man archive. Dreamstone Archive. Archive. Yeah, I'll choose that. Okay. I choose Vincer. Then, sir. 
Now we all right, all these go back in the bottom in the random order. Yep. To be fair, are you sure you didn't know I was going to pick Vincent? I only said it seven times. He did. See, I have a thing now where I'm trying to fit Vencer in my deck every week since Steven went through that whole thing. <laughs> I smell it! <laughs> because if he smells it, then maybe, uh, I don't know. I don't know, it's going to help you. It's, it's going to be alright. I don't know if it's going to help me, help me, but... Um, there's so much going on here. I'd really like to not die to all your stuff. Uh... Well, you equip that wall, mm, then you got a blocker. I would have a very big blocker, you're right. But instead of that, I'm going to put all your stuff back. I'm going to draw a card. You get, your, you get your sword back, Steven. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Sarcasm, John. You didn't want your sword? <laughs> I didn't want six permanents in my hand. You can recast them, right? No, I can't. <laughs> Just you got okay. I'm gonna play the Wayfair Bobble, and now I've got seven in hand, so I will go ahead and just say go. Seven in hand, eh? Listen, I wouldn't be doing all this if you guys didn't decide to chop me down twenty-seven life points oh, to start. The they, game. they decided to do that. <laughs> Steven, I, I, Steven. I, have, I have attacked you. 20, I have a Brimaz seven. damage, and I took damage life. from a Snooze yeah. creature. One Brimaz damage, and you took one for the team. That's true. I took seven from you, though. So from the team, seven for the team. For the team, I did it. I did it for the team. There's an easy ten damage I didn't throw on you. That's for true. It is. Team. Uh, John, you should first, be thanking Stephen. I, I am be, very First, I'm going to play this ruination guide again and scry one. Stuff, John. You can't listen to a word out of Justin's mouth. And I then don't know he's then, gonna kill. Me. I'm aware. Then I'm going to play this Ashiok Dream Render. Even though you made a deal with the devil by telling him your role. Ashiok Dream Render. You didn't ask why, him if I sent him your role, did I? Why would you have that? Wait, does that say I can't search my library? I can't search your library? Correct. Okay. And it exiles all the graveyards. Yep. I told you he has to Mill? get some cards. He has to exile Four cards. And it's, then it's, it, ha it has to be exiling. Exile, exile 50 cards. Uh, I will uh, uh, tick, do it. tick down and target John since he has the. I mean, it doesn't matter. All of our graveyards get exiled. Uh, target player puts the top four cards of their library into their graveyard, then exile each opponent's graveyard. So oh, yeah. Yeah. Mill you. yeah, thank you for getting rid of this ill drowsy. Do you need to know how many cards are exiled, Jeremy? I don't. <laughs> See, he's going to wait until he's closer to Gallo. <laughs> That's then, smart, Jeremy. That's smart. Then, don't, don't fall for it. And then I am going to pass the turn. Yeah, don't fall for it, Jeremy. He's trying to get you to... Yeah, uh, Jeremy, you don't have to discard any cards or anything? I have been stuck on three-ish cards for quite a while. I have 12 cards in my hand. That's because you're on four lands and all your mana. I, I bounced <laughs> Ruination <laughs> Guide, Arcane Signet, well, and you already knew I had this Vile Redeemer, and you yeah, know I have yeah, all this Dustin Kindred. You're correct, and you put two mana in my hand repeatedly. I, I play Fellwarstone. Stone. Thanks to Jeremy, I can't re keep repeating it. I'm going to play Sin Triplets. Yeah. And then I'm going to play Godless Shrine Tapped. Because I did have this cute little Monomic Wall evacuation plan going And on. I'm done after that. Jeremy decided to play the ruiner of that. You're welcome. Here comes the mana rocks. I mean, there's not really much else I can do. All right, I'm going to bobble. Bobble, bobble, bobble. Man, Justin's going to get me again. <laughs> <laughs> Steven, that's up to you. You want to give him your you know information? The, you know the way out. Yeah, he's going to keep making that deal over and over and over again until he knows all of our secrets. I just want to. I just want to know. I just want to know so I can be prepared. Yeah, you'll know once I successfully do it. Oh. Oh I, yeah, I can't. That's true. Spells and abilities. Your opponent yeah. control can't. Boo! I should have did that in response to Ashiok. Do you want to um, just do that since you had the mana open? Sure, I had the mana. Uh, yeah. And it's exile to Ashiok too, then. Yeah. I can't discard this card. No. 
Was that prismatic strands that you discarded? Yeah. Yeah. That card's really good. He's gonna, you know what? I'll never cast him again. You're all done. Yeah, Jeremy's just gonna remove the graveyard again. So I can't really. Yeah, every time he activates it, it's just gonna keep you yeah, coming back. No, I can't just like stand back my prismatic strands in there. Yeah. To get someone later. That's not gonna work. Steven, we can go ahead and save time, and if you just want to go ahead and tell me your role now, I'll go ahead and commit to targeting Jeremy. Nope. For the sin triplets. You target me. I'm not telling you. I will target you. It's the same. It's literally the same hand you looked at last time. I know. Oh, I don't know. No, 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 there's an additional card in here, so I'm sorry. Yep. But, uh, I just got to And there's the other heat drawn. Mm -hmm. All right. That's, that's my turn. I had to also play my mana ramp from from uh your from your bounce. From my bounce. I'm playing mountain. Uh I'm gonna go after uh Steven Green. What do I do? Uh you're just gonna mill four and then everybody's gonna exile. The if it's four lands, Jeremy, I'm just gonna quit. We get a <laughs> three Steven. lands. Three lands. Uh, he said it had to be four. He's still there. Uh, I'm going <laughs> to replay Morathon, the Boundless, for nine mana. Uh, I'll respond. Okay. I'll put Morathon, the Boundless, back into my commands. Yeah, that's, that's where it's going to end up. I'm going to pay five. I'm going to counter that and bounce send triplets. Oh, that's not nice. Man, John, you let me discard my Bremas? <laughs> I'm gonna attack John you, for three. What does that even mean? And I uh, let you do it. Well, it costs three, man. That costs seven, man. You let me walk into that and ingest one. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, pass, barrel. Pass that turn. Wait, oh, what God. happened? Why? Why does it matter that I? <laughs> it does. I'm, I'm missing something. No. I, I did that because I thought he was gonna take it with six triplets, but he's oh, not. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. So I wasn't gonna do that for what it's worth. <laughs> Uh, but I didn't want more falling back. To <laughs> Listen, the last time I remember Jeremy playing more fun, he played it, and then a bunch of dragons, and then we all died. Yeah, that's dragons. true. I remember that happening very specifically. Very um, I'm going to tap four, and I'm going to play clever impersonator. Ooh, what Is would you good? like? Oh, I feel another like one? that's going to be an Ashiak. No, I'm, what? I'm going to get the Hedron. Yeah, yeah, so wants the Hedron. Oh, okay. I was like, oh, no, not again. I'll never get lands at this it's rate. Definitely yeah. not Ashiak. I was really hoping it would be Ashiak and Bill Steven. No, that's that'd be so mean. Oh, that'd be so fun and mean. All right. It was fun, Jeremy. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because you're the one that's always milling people. True. Justin specifically. And so it would I'm be specifically sweet. billing him, not yeah, me. Yeah, and it would be sweet to have Justin Six. mill you. Send triplets. There it is. It's back. It's back. Again. I'm done. Again. Again. What happens here? That's if up what? to you. Well, what happens is that Justin says, hey, Steven, I'll make you What's the same deal. If you tell me what your role is, I won't target you with send triplets. And then he'll target me and see the same three cards. I feel like that's just fair, though. It's just fair of me to do it. I'm done. Got Sword of Sinu and Steel and Mangar the Diplomat. Now, I don't like the sword because I feel like he might come at me with it. You got a lot of juice over there. I got the juice. Blow it up if you need to. I no, I don't, I don't want to blow it up. I got no interest in that. I cast it so that Justin can't cast it. Man, this <laughs> stupid Ashiok preventing me from searching. Hmm. I mean, this gives me the outside chance to threaten you back, Justin. Like, if you do that, then I will attempt to suit up Mangara and attack someone to kill your syndrome. I know that you will. Yeah. We'll just, I gotta need something. Well, you have it. You, you have it. All, you have your information. I just want to extract it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to play Agent of Treachery. No, I'm going to have send triplets. Well, I do not like that. 
I don't like that at all. Because no. we haven't seen Justin's hand. <laughs> well, how are you going to make him you... the same offer? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> how, how big is the uh, ten triplets? It's a three three. It's not very big. Big enough. You can play cards from their hand. That's dumb. Or fun. Depends on how you look at things. Ah, <sighs> cryptic command. You're going to go bye bye to that. Stupid oh, ash, yeah. I forgot to. Not if you play it in a monic wall. Forgot to. Start. Yeah, the problem is I'd rather hold the Venser that you gave me. So, because hey, you know Venser. All right, I am done. Hey, Jeremy, Jeremy, yeah. uh, do you want a colorless creature to attack John with? Yeah, please. <laughs> it would get bigger. It would get bigger. It would get bigger. I'm, that's what I'm would, asking you. It would only be a two one though. So is that a no? It would. All right. Let's let's go with no for now. All right. That was a, uh, a free a free two one. Yep. Look at what you did, Justin. You're trying to trying to get in people's good graces, and no one wants them. Uh, I don't know why. No one wants your graces. Let's. I don't. I don't know why. Mill. The only only one player hates getting milled, Jeremy. Yeah. Steven. Let's mill Steven for four. <laughs> Oh, 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 man. Oof. All right. Crypt command is gone. Oof. Man, I really don't want you to uh, send triplets anybody at all. Oh, I do. I really want to send triplets to people. I really just want to know what Justin's got. He's been sitting over there doing nothing the whole game except for playing send triplets. Well, that's all I've <laughs> And he's got plenty of mana. And that's how many cards are in your hand, Justin? Six ish. Yeah, six ish. Yeah, six -ish. that's what I thought. He has nothing to do. Just six cards and twelve mana. Yeah. Uh, Justin, I'll make you a new deal. What's your new deal? Yeah, you you're trying to find information. You have to send me your information in return for my information. You have to uh, send <laughs> six <laughs> mana. Look for an equal trade of information. You, you go ahead and you go ahead and shoot up for your roll, and I'll tell you what mine is. Now, what does that do? Because it's not going to happen. Six mana. I'm going to play Deep Fathom Skulker. It's a four four devoid. Whenever a creature you control deals combat damage to a player, you may draw a card. Three in a colorless target creature can't be blocked this turn. Target creature. Yep. Not any. Not just yours. Correct. That's and I'm going to five too. Like a five I power now. It's a this is it is a five four five four now with I can't, uh, ruin I can't believe you did not well, want a two a free two one. <laughs> yeah, okay. Maybe you didn't have that, to be fair. It's true. I know you to, I know. to attack John with, with his two three and his three three is what you're saying? Jeremy, I'm not saying you can't I don't know if you can't kill his other creatures. Technically you could have just attacked Justin with it, Jeremy. I'm going to attack Justin card. for three so that I can draw a card. <laughs> I'll take three and I'll exile chromatic lantern. <laughs> You definitely should have took him and then attacked him. <laughs> uh, I will play Field of Ruin as my land for the turn. Yeah. And then I will pass the turn. All right. No send triplets for me. No, it's right here. It's hanging out. I am the captain now. Okay. I'm going to tap now for... For the rest of you, I'm only targeting Justin. Just letting gonna, you know. I'm going to tap Forbidden Orchard. Who's getting it? Jeremy's going to get it. I'm trying to help him out. Um, three colorless, white. I cast Wrath of God. Uh, trying to help me out, he says. Momentarily. Might not resolve. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna swan song it. In fact, does not resolve. You get a bird though. Fly pelicans, fly. I do get a bird. I'm sure I don't have that. Probably don't not. Don't have a Derek Sheets. Oh, I do. Un right. Unbelievable. I live Un with Derek Sheets. Unbelievable. All right, I'm gonna play uh, Arcane Sanctum. Tapped. And I have one mana. I'll play my own Mangara. I'm going to draw a card. Yep. One, two. You just need white, right? Yeah, one, two, three, four.
Yep. All right. I'm done. How many cards do you have in hand, John? I only have four. Jeez. Oh, you know three of them. I'm going to equip Mangara. I'm going to attack Ashiok. You give him that... I'm not doing that. You give him that token. See yeah, I got the token. Don't attack... Look, Steven, what do you want to kill? Ashiok. What? Okay. <laughs> what do you want artifact... What artifact do you want to kill? Well, what kind of... What, which artifact do you think I would choose? Central Are you force. trying to say, okay, here you go, Joseph. Make your I'll, let you, I'll attack you. All right. I will not block if you kill the Sin Triplets and then you can kill the Ashiok. You can kill both of them. I will attack you. I won't block. Damage? Yep. I will, I will kill the Ashiok and Sin Triplets. I was going to blow up. I was going to target him, though, Steven. Listen. Uh, uh, yes, at first you are, but like well, nah, the next turn, nah. the next turn, and the next turn, and the next turn. Unless his hand is garbage, you're not. It gonna was going to be another him. one, and you then another one. You can't resist power. If he doesn't have power in his hand, there's no way you target him again. You, I know you better than that. You don't know. I got like nine <laughs> cards in my hand. I am on the list. I'm getting God. They're not. They're already <laughs> suck. They're just on the, the list. On you the say list. they suck, but you can cast them all. Because yeah, they're, they're colorless. They don't do anything, though. <laughs> Anyone can cast them. Uh, on the <laughs> list is fantastic. All right. <laughs> okay, now I'm thinking about what else I should do. If I play another spell, Justin gets to draw a card. That's true. No, you haven't cast any spells. I haven't cast any spells, so I could play oh, one just, thing. Yeah. Yeah, you'll make uh, I'm gonna cast Smother in town. That's a good one Ooh. if you're gonna pick one to uh, cast. I mean, right now it looks like more than everybody can pay the tax. Uh, thinking about on. thinking about that one. Yeah, just because I can doesn't mean I want to. Yeah. <laughs> you, you got me I'll there, respond. John. I'm just saying. Like, I'll respond. I'm gonna draw three cards. It's a lot okay. of draw power there. So yep. it you got it. Okay. Uh, well, well. I don't care if Justin has a card. I I guess I care. Go ahead. One tap. I'm not gonna pay. Oh no, really? Treasure number one. Uh, I got some mana. We finally got some mana. Wee! Maybe no one will pay, and I can cast spells. Uh, it's fantastic, Steven. No, your your Ashiok can just go somewhere. Seven mana, or something like that. That's what I got rid of. I'll cast Fiddlethip. Draw card. Yep. You still got that armor? Laying, laying around somewhere? The plate? Old director yeah. Kyle bringing up Fibble Thip like it's you know, <laughs> like, uh, just no immediately. That does you know? Yeah, you gotta read that whole text box. I, 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 I admire he does it by habit, okay? And he definitely wants everyone to see Fibble Thip. Uh, he's just got his foil copy sitting there. That's a lot of mana, John. And just oh, I sacked three of it. I gotta rebuild it. What is it? What did you play? A Sky Diamond. Okay. Yeah, it's a lot of mana, so watch out. Well, everything's a lot of mana to Steven. Well, I thought you sacked at the end of your turn. I did. Sack, sacked at the end of your turn. Then he cast Fibblethip for six. Yeah. I, I, it's, I'm just looking at it like it costs two mana is what it is. is it it mana? doesn't. You should have a lot of mana for Fibblethip. I sure did, for Fibblethip. Yeah, for Fibblethip. <laughs> um, okay, I think that's where I stopped. Man. I really don't want to give... I, I played a second spell, so you guys can draw. Oh, you did. We both get a draw. Hooray! Oh. Whoa, wait a minute. And, and Steven gets a trigger. Are you paying, Justin? No. Nah. All right. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm good. Go ahead. 
Oh, the Ash Yacht's gone now. Yeah, you can. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I, just I should, should, not have, should not have played that. All right, I cool. destroyed it. You sure did. Justin helped. It's true. It came Somber. in price. I really didn't want Ash Yacht gone, but I did want Sin Triplets. Not under John's control. <laughs> you wanted it gone, but you want it back. Well, you're going to get it back. and Eventually, yeah. I'm going to cast Vanquisher's Banner. Hmm. Wonder what mm -hmm. you're going to choose. Naming Eldrazi, if that's okay. Steven, I don't think he paid the two on his turn. I did not pay the two on my turn. You can you can have it. I feel bad because you, you did get milled for a lot of mana there. I only need a couple more, you know? I only ask you for a couple more mana. Now he's got it. Now I got it. And... Eldrazi is what you chose, I assume. Yeah, I did, Not I did, choose, I did choose Eldrazi. Uh, and then I will move to attacks. Yep. I'm going to attack Steven just because he's at 44. Trigger. Yep. Two or more. You get to draw a card? Sure. Yep. 44 is uh, a lot. I'm, I'm going to take it. So it's, so be it's six. So it's 10 oh, total. 10 total. Yeah, it's he 10. just keeps doing it. He keeps getting mana. The box oval. Do you box really need a box oval? You don't know what I need. I'm pretty sure you don't. It's 10. And then uh, I will draw two cards. You going to pay? Nope. You both can. Yes, Steven can confirm. I don't you, get uh... anything. You didn't need mox opal, Steven. You don't know what I got going on. For the I, turn. I do. I know I, enough. As much free mana as possible would be great. That way, when you devastation tide, I can just put it right back into play. It it's exile. Gone. It's gone. That's the only one you got. You already tried that, to evacuate. You didn't have that, enough mana to pull it off. I did. No, -uh, you didn't pay your tide. Oh, I <laughs> cast it. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Uh, I'll pay five. I'll play Blight Herder. Draw a card. Uh, I've got a couple of triggers. Um, so I'm going to scry with the uh, Path of Ancestry. And then I also have a Vanquisher's Banner. Are you drawing a card for second spell? Uh, for yeah. second spell that I cast for the turn. I'll also draw a card. Yeah. Um, so I could definitely use the mana now. I, cards can. I have 10 well, cards you, in my hand. There's also another another treasure token from Justin. Yeah, I'm not going to pay. Ooh, 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 yeah, you, yeah. you don't need yeah. any of them. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm going to draw that card. And then... Um, oh, he drew a card too. Yeah, yeah I drew a card from Vanquisher's Banner. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you really needed that Mox Opal. I didn't think about it. You're right. I apologize. Uh, and then <laughs> when when I cast Blight Herder, I may put two cards your opponent's own from exile into their owner's graveyards. If I do put three 1-1 one, one colorless Eldrazi Scion creature tokens onto the battlefield, uh, I am going to put... I got you. No, uh, no, Two lands, yeah, from yeah. Stevens. Yeah, I got you. Right. With, yeah, I got with you. that ability, with that ability on the stack... Yes. Um... I'm going to cast uh, Anguished on Making on your banner. Okay. I'll lose three life, go to 16. Exiled? Yeah. All right. Who's doing the exile in now? All right. And then, so now I have three. And... Gee, Steven. If you'd left that send triplets in play, I'd have had all these cards from Justin this turn. All these cards? <laughs> I'm not... That would have been a mind anguish I'm making. I'd have had some fun stuff, man. Yeah, and then I will pass the turn. I don't think I want to do that. So, yeah, I'll pass the turn. All right. I will draw. All right. I'm going to play a Castle Vantress as my land for the turn. Hmm. Hmm, hmm is right. This is this is a three mana make three mana sack pay three sack it draw three. Yep. Okay. Southern Tide's a the good card. It is a it is a good card. it is a good card. I didn't now. see if you paid. Did you pay? No, I don't think anybody's paid anything. I have yeah, I'm not gonna pay. I promise you. Not, not going to play. Time is going to cast a whole boatload of colorless cards before Centriplets can take them from me. I don't know that he's even going to recast Centriplets yet. Yeah, I don't know if I am either. 
Well, I think, I think he realizes that send triplets is probably not the uh, the play he needs to make. No, it doesn't really do a whole lot. It sure doesn't. It takes a the, long time for it does anything. Is do the you problem have the wrath of God because I would allow it. This this wrath of God that John countered last yeah, turn. Another, I, another one, another one, a different I, one. I don't, I don't have another one. Do you have a second copy of Wrath of God in your Singleton deck? Yeah, Day of Judgment. Oh. Yeah, or, Day of Judgment. Or, or, no, 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 he specifically or, said Wrath of God. I'm going to play Ponder. Him. Okay, damnation. There you go. Ponder. He's going to ponder. That's going to get you a card or a treasure, Stephen. And I'll take it. Stephen's just going to go off and like murder us all. He is going to add a metric ton of mana to us. That's go crazy. off, huh? Don't act like it's not something you can do. I can. <laughs> you can play your entire hand. Uh, I'm com- confident in that. Wait, okay. One. All right. Um, I'm gonna put them. On, I'm gonna put them on top. I don't really want all the cards, but I want. I don't think one, so. one no, of them. It's close. It's close. Well, your Eldrazi Constriction's exiled, so you don't have to yeah, cast that one. That's true, but I, I I sacrificed myself for the team on that one. Justin didn't play a land that turn, by the way. He played a Felwar song. I still remember. So he didn't hit his natural eighth land unless he was sandbag. True. One. You know, this game would have been a lot different if that winter word would have resolved. Yeah. yeah, I think I think this would have just changed a lot. Three. Yeah, three that's probably what. I... Oh, actually, probably. it wouldn't have mattered. You'd have devastation tied. That's true. Sure. So. One, two, three, four, five. Mm hmm. I want to play Crush Contraband. Choose I'll, one or both. Draw I'll, choose, I'll, I'll choose both. Mm-hmm. I'm going to choose. Uh, I think we can all agree, including Steven, that Smothering Tide is probably it's time for it to go. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Miss all the enchantment in play, isn't it? Huh? Probably, probably. Yeah. Probably. probably. Either way, it's, to, it's to, time to go, Smothering Tide. <laughs> <laughs> oh. yeah. I can't yeah. have permanent mana. I have fleeting yeah. mana. I got it. Yeah, you only cast, you know, three dark rituals with it. I'm going to get Hadron Archive as my other target. Jerk. Steven, you may be keeping your, your smothering tithe. Is, the, is, that, is that worth? Is that yeah, worth it? Yeah, yeah, 100%. Worth in having all that? What? Yeah. Listen, wait till you see all that. I cannot wait to show you my turn where you guys are like, oh. Okay. Hadron Archive, that's what you want to come after? That's what I want. You're going to regret that. Sickness be gone. Oop, he said okay. Well, John must be able to counter during my turn. He can't, he can't let the shields down. He's, well, he's, got, he's, no. he's got a Vincer. It's Vincer. You know that. Okay. How many cards are in your hand? Seven. So you have six Vincers as far as I'm concerned. I have, well, no, because you know most of the cards <laughs> in my hand. God. I know Blight and Vincer. And Monomic Wall. Six vents. Oh, 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 okay. That's All basically right. not a vents, I don't trust it. For six mana, I'm going to play Warm Coil Engine. Wait, did I draw a card off the... No. Oh, no, I don't know. I'm not worried about it. I got enough cards. <laughs> Warm Coil Engine, does that resolve? Yeah. Yep. All right. I'm going to pass the turn. I only have three in hand, by the way. Steven, Steven's got a million in hand. He does. I'll play a base of it. Um, we'll cast Hammer of the Zon. That's pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Not a sword, but... I'll put, it on, I'll put it on Mingara. Yeah. Um, cast Felwar Song. I'll draw a card. Felwar Song. Thran Dynamo. <laughs> yeah, John. Yeah. 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 You didn't. You didn't need Mox Opal. Can confirm. Yeah, I did. I did. It turns out I didn't. I didn't expect that many. Uh, uh, Thran Dynamo will cast Sword of Body in mind. Now that one I don't like particularly because that that gives it pro my pro, stuff. Pro blue. What? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna hope that I'm not the target. So all right. All right. I think- I think Steven you has to cast. To... You have to equip it. No, I don't. The Hammer of Design says whenever 
hammer or another equipment. In or its another, you said. Under your control, <laughs> you may attack right. that equipment to target creature. You I, think, All right. I think Steven has to put five equipment on a single creature. Well, that's, that's coming. A, um, that's a good... Sort of feast of favor. Good guess. I, oh, jeez. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Yep. Uh, Swift foot boots. This is number five. Well, it's not five. That's five yeah, equipment. Yeah, it's not. That's not, it's not what it is. And the last one, lightning groups. Six equipment. Six, Six equipments. equipments on a single yeah. creature. I believe that is what it is. Six <laughs> equipment. I got it. <laughs> yeah, I guess it was six equipments on a single yeah. creature. Uh, yeah, exactly. I can't believe it. it would never have happened without that enchantment ever. Hmm. That's fantastic. So, Stephen, that, uh, is, that is your. Uh, yeah, I think it is. I'm just double checking. Kyle could just speak up. Yep. Ready to battle. Control yeah, could just stick some more equipment. All right. Yep. Okay. I knew it. Whew, that's a big creature. I don't even know what to do with it now. Good. It's good. I um, like it. You've done it, though. <laughs> Whatever it is you need to do, you did it. You um, have an indestructible pro red, pro black, pro green, pro blue. I can't really attack. Pro me. white. Ah, it's it, got it's not sword. It, it, it doesn't have vigilance, though. Yeah, it does have vigilance. I can't really. It attack. does have life link. Uh, John, I just. Uh, what well, if I attack you? You you bounce my sword and block. Yes, that is exactly what happens. <laughs> um, but I would prefer you not do that. I think, I'll just I'll block with warm coil engine. I think I might just sit. Jeremy's for, all of his creatures are colorless. Yeah. yeah, I think I'll just sit for a turn. Block with a little spirit. That's I fine. Made my goal, and I really thought it was going to be really hard to do. And here we and are. You, you did it in one turn. Yeah. Yeah. Well, if the didn't have hammer and was on with a little help there. from uh, one of one of the best white spells to come out. And yeah. All right, I'm done. A long, You're long a time. Hey, you protect yourself, John. You know, I left you your vincer, so you didn't have to do anything to me. It's true. It's exactly how it worked. So I just all did a plan. So what is Jeremy's role? I don't He's know. he has to either he has a, it's not exile cards, cast non. I think he has to cast colorless cards that aren't artifacts, like a certain number of those. I'm gonna guess twenty. Twenty colorless cards that aren't artifacts. Twenty-five um, colorless cards that aren't artifacts. Gonna wow. play an island. Fifteen's too low. Man, it's not looking good over here. It's not looking good, Stephen. That is a the creature's just monstrous. It's a uh, okay. So it's a it's, billion it's, billion. It, it it is. Um, it's a ten ten, indestructible. Yep. Yeah. Pro blue, pro red, pro black, pro green. So it's not protection from white. It is pro everything, yeah, for the most part. Except except not for, white. Not white. For, except for white. Oh, I thought that was a... It doesn't, it doesn't really matter because Justin can hand out colorless tokens to block with at least. Yeah. <laughs> but what if... Hmm. Well... You're right. You're right. That is what it does. I think I'm just kind of at the mercy of things here, so let's just do what we're doing. You can do whatever you want to, man. Fill your role. I, I, uh, I'm I, just going to do my thing. I'm going to play Imperial Plate. There it is. Yep. Quit. Yep. Yep. Fiddle thip. Can Justin. you trample? No, I can't, but I'm going to give it unblockable with Rogue's Passage and attack Justin. Whew. That's for how much? Seven total. Steven. Don't let him deal 21. Uh, well, I'm, I'm just saying, don't yeah, let him deal yeah, 21. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean, I'll, I'll, take, I'll take seven. Yeah, I'm not amazing right. this. Uh, after that, I am done. I got Vencer mana open, I see. I do, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm pretty much at the mercy of whoever decides they want to try and kill me. So we're just going <laughs> to hang out. I'm going to be honest, you're at 10. I don't know if I could stop Jeremy from killing you if he had that Vanquisher's banner out. Oh, I don't know if I could stop him from killing me, period. I'm going to play Shrine of the Forsaken Gods. Well, it makes two mana. Wait. But I could tell you without, with, with certainty 
that Jeremy, if he is left alive long enough, is going to have some scary Eldrazi's. I don't know about scary. It's a lot of this ah, kind of stuff. And yeah, I don't trust couple, that. There's a couple that are scary. I don't trust it one bit. They may not annihilate, but I bet they're real big. Or maybe they do annihilate. I don't know how scummy you want them to be there. It's true. Um, you had a little mill going on there. There's no way you don't have the CC Swinger. Jeremy, you got enough for more fun or not? I can't count it for myself. Uh, technically, yes. It's a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That's how much I need. Okay. But he also has Venser, and he's just going to put it right back in my hand. Uh, Only if you come at me with it. Yeah, it's just going to depend on who you attack. It all depends on who's coming at where. what. Well, there goes Malcolm. Now, if you attack me, I'm going to gain 10 life guaranteed. But you Are probably you? get more than 10 damage. Well, I'm going to block. Okay. Uh, I'm going to play Smothering Tithe, because I like yours so much. Good idea. Like it. It's pretty cool. Uh, and then... I am going to say that Attack. what's on block one, two, three, four. Uh, Deep Fathom Skulker is going to make itself unblockable. Mm. Yep. Um. Oh, Jeremy, please have nine damage. It's unblockable. I think that's it. Please have nine. Why nine? Because of Justin? Because someone's at nine, and I don't want <laughs> you to have ten, because well, then it might be me. Ten. He does have nine. Blight Herder and Deep Fathom is nine. Yeah, Blight Herder and Deep Fathom are both together. That's ten. It's, ten. it's also ten. It's not nine. It's I thought ten. it was a three-three. Yeah, but I'm not going to use Venser to save you. I'm going to use Venser to save me. There's a difference. Oh, Blight Herder's a four-five? Why don't I think it's a three-three? It is a four-five. Four-five. Okay, he does have 10, as it turns out. He has exactly 10. Unblockable. Oh, uh, well, I mean, that's not good, though, right, John? He knows you'll bit, sir. Only if he attacks me. Yeah. Um, it's not worth a point to just die anyways in the next, the next turn. Uh, I am going to swing at Steven for five. I'm going to Maze of Ith. Oh, you have Maze of Ith. That's right. Um, I would not have done that then. Well, forgot. Steven you. was probably gonna. I imagine he was gonna get a point. Well, one if you way or the try other. to kill someone, I'm gonna go for a point. Or John yeah. is. Uh... Yeah, I'm. I'm just gonna deep fathom skulker Justin then for just five. Um, I just want to draw the card really more than it. Not gonna. Not gonna maze that. All right, I'll take it. Um, I really think Jeremy probably should turn all his creatures sideways at me. Just let one of them die. Possibly. And then I am mm. going to pass the turn. Now. Yes. You only cast one spell, right? You, I did only cast right, one I'm not spell. Doing, I'm not doing anything. Go, go for it. You have at it. Justin, can you like destroy all non-white creatures? I discarded. No. Um... You discarded that? Yeah, I did. A long time ago. I never had seven mana on it. <laughs> now, now, Justin, when you said don't let Thibble Dip deal lethal 21 or whatever to you, yeah. did you mean by letting them kill you instead? Well, that's better than it, it dealing that amount. I mean, on my turn, I could just put you out of your misery. I feel like anyone could put me out of my misery. That's true. But then you'd be going out on your own terms if I attacked you and did it. <laughs> oh, that's so nice of you. <laughs> I'm I'm gonna cast the card of Mind Slaver. Oof. Hold on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> John. It's not coming to you. I know it's not coming to me. I'm just trying to figure out why it's there. Oh Justin. Oh, and if this is if this is Director Kyle's doing, then I'll deal with him later. I saw that, Jeremy. Yeah, uh, Malcolm uh, Malcolm freaked himself out and knocked over my light. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I man, mind slaver? Malcolm. Oh, you can probably go through the counter that, John. I don't like I don't like your chances if he takes my turn. Nah. Nah. I don't care. 
Listen, if he's going to play the card Mind Slaver, I'm going to make him have to deal with playing it over. Uh, That'd be you know. Mind Slaver's you. Well, that's fine. He can Mind Slaver me. Why would I Mind Slaver John? Because John. you can guess his Vincer and his shields would be down. There you go. That's it. <laughs> Yeah, were you nodding off and you just scared yourself? You have a buried rune too, don't you? I do. I don't have. I don't have a way to recur mind slaver. Anyway. Yeah, for sure. No, it's 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 good. I but care. I put bur- I put buried rune in to get a get a, you know, second chance at it. Yeah. Well, I I mean I have I have other artifacts. It's not just okay. Me. I think his goal is to just cast our stuff. Maybe. Jeremy. Well, that mind slaver lets me believe it's just to cast it. Yes. Jeremy. Yeah. Yes. If you tell me your role. I won't target you with this mind slaver. Gotta check and see if Justin ever sent you a message about his role. Here's but, the thing, Jeremy. You yeah. don't care if he targets you with my, with with that. Maybe N- not really. I, mean, kill all, I kill all of his creatures. Yeah, he maybe kills all my creatures with like kindred dominance or whatever. Yeah, yeah, I guess kindred. Yeah, whatever. Jeremy, all there's, you have to do is three if, creatures in play. If you just tell me, I got my phone. Fo- I got my phone right here. Jeremy, don't you? I'm not offering this to Stephen. Hold strong, Jeremy. Hold strong. Don't. If I'm, you, not, I'm, not, I'm not offering it to him. Yeah. Like, no, he's listen, always going to do that. He's always going to be like, I'm going to make you a deal. And then he's immediately going to go, like, ruin something because of the deal. No, no. Yeah. I, listen, listen. Just This is where he, uh, he turns me off. you into listen, things before listen. he infinite combos you. Hold no. Me. First of all, John, that's, that's, that's a low blow. Uh, if you just tell me your role, uh-huh. I will not take your turn. I'll take Stevens and I'll use all of my resources on Steven to hurt John and not you. Even if it's overkill on John, Mm-mm. even if it's overkill on John, I will not do anything on Steven's turn to damage you in any way. I will. I'll run. I'll run everything by you. Don't. Don't. Oh, my goodness. Sounds very cowardly. I really don't like not taking my turn. <laughs> that is my it deal. Like, it looks like Jeremy's giving you his answer. Otherwise, otherwise, I'm gonna take your turn. You go ahead and take my turn. All right, I'm going to. I'm not gonna do it right now because I don't have to. <laughs> but I am ultimately gonna so take your turn. It costs four to activate. Four. Yes. How much to activate the buried room? Two. Uh, two and sacrifice it. Yeah. He can buy it back to his hand, but yeah. I don't well, know. What if I doesn't do much? Him, if I strip mine his and I force him to do it. Then. I don't think he cares, though. I would just, I'll just let it go. I just let it die. Yeah. Bairdruin's not in here, like specifically for mind slaver. Well, I don't want you to do it more than once. I'm gonna be real. Well, I'm doing it to Jeremy. All right, by well, his, you, by are, his are request. You, are you doing anything else? My request. Yeah, definitely really not a. Do. I'm gonna blackmail you. You uh, give me this mail. answer, or I was, I'm going to take your turn and ruin everything. Is what you said. Is what you actually said. Without that's exactly saying. what happened. I'm not ruining it for no, me, no, no, no. Jeremy. That is. That I'm is trying what to help, said. Jeremy. You said, I'm for life, man. You, you have said, the you have the ability to kill me. No one else does. I will blackmail you. No one. You either tell me just what just your, your me secret you role is, life. or you get six life for attacking me, and you get two more blockers. True. When I get do two you? more, I get, how do I get two more blockers? Well, his creature's indestructible, so yeah, I would just eat your worm coil, and then you you get mm, that's true. Blocker, it's two blockers. Yeah, I actually, uh, I am gonna, I am gonna attack Steven for six. Well, I'm gonna block the worm coil. What's up with the Mangar? He's attacking me. I get attack, a or attacking well, him for eight. He said Sorry. six. That's what for I was eight. Okay. Yeah. Um, draw. I'm gonna, um, yeah, I did draw. Okay. I'll gain eight. So I will only gain eight. And Since I took two for Mangar. took two, yeah. I'm Should back be. at 40. That was a good deal for you. Didn't suck. All right. I'm done. Steven, how big is your Mangar now? Jeez. It's, it's big. Two, four, six, eight, ten, yeah. yeah. We'll go to attackers. Yep. I'm going to take John. So it's only got one thing that's pro blue? Mm-hmm. All right. Well, you know what I have to do to try and live, so. I'll play better. 
Bounce sword of body and mind. Yep, to my hand. You have a 8 8 Mangara. Non trample, though, right? Non trample, that's correct. There's no cool. trample. Um, it does, does have lifelink, though. Yeah. If you take it, I uh, would get to untap all my lands. So. Uh, no, I'm not taking unblocking. Um, <laughs> I was like, I'm not let's just be real clear about what's happening here. We're not doing it. Yeah, uh, I wouldn't suggest taking it, but you know, yeah, you I'm just gonna yeah, agent treasury can bite it. Okay. Well, if We're I just take it and just go to you know, two, you life, yeah, yeah, that's probably. Right. Gas and pre mass. The king. King. The king. And then... He uh, has returned. I'm done, you're up. On to... Draw. How many cards do you have in your hand after you draw? After I draw, I have a six magic cards. Now, six means that Fibblethip has seven. Seven power? And you have 14? I have 14. All right. Let's do. Give Fibblethip the lost cannot be blocked this turn. Yep. And then let's strip mine Stevens Maze of Um, I don't like that. You don't? Nope. Hmm. Um. I feel like I'm not gonna be able to do what I want to do because you have so much mana. You got a lot of mana. You do. You have a lot. You have a lot. Why you pop my maze fit, you scumbag? Because I wasn't gonna let you try and milk a point. Milk a point. I'm trying to keep Jeremy from uh, bashing me and drawing cards. True, but still, the point remains. Um, negotiated. Yeah, but you know, you oh, know, I Stephen. Know. Oh, I know. You know. What negotiation am I going to do that's going to let you're going to be like, yeah, yeah you can have that. <laughs> <laughs> like, let's just be real here. So, I mean, I guess you'd have to guarantee Justin dies. Like, he isn't. Yeah, and I can't guarantee Justin dies. True. Um, that I cannot do. I'm trying to think if there's a way that I can Actually, draw against you, Justin. I just kind of want to kill everybody in the game end. So you know, yeah. But why? Why kill me first? Well, yeah. I, I'm not choosing you. John, John will be choosing you. Well, but but like, you can. Whoever, I'm a fan of whoever dies first, even if it's me. All right, Justin. I'm attacking you for seven. Okay. I can't block, right? Nope. All right. I have no blocks. I'm going to pass priority. Yep. For me, anyways. Jeremy? Well, Steven's first, and then me. Uh, I am passing priority. Oh, you All right, take damage. Oh, uh, no, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You said no blocks. Yeah, there's there's spots in between. Uh, I don't know. I think that there are. Steven, what you got? Uh, if you t All you have to do is target it, and... Yeah, I have a generous gift. I'll, I'll target uh, Fizzletail with a generous gift. Steven. Well, uh, it gets John two points. If he kills me, two points. Yeah. And I get a point for saving you. You do. Steve. Now, I might not have done not, this. Nah, it's a you, don't, it, you don't get a point if I get a card out of my hand, right? Because then it wouldn't have killed him. It's, it's already dead. It's already happened. It doesn't it's, matter. The trigger's in the stack. It gets targeted, it dies, right? Yeah, there are ways to stop triggers, Steven. Calm down. Um. Man, I didn't like that, Steven. I'm not happy with you. He did blow up his maze myth. Well, he would have also did that. I don't know. If you sent me your role and a message, maybe I wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> I think my role has been pretty clear since we started. I think so, too. So, I, you know, I don't really need you to tell me. 
But um, I'm going to put my generous gift in the graveyard regardless. Yeah, it's going to the graveyard. Uh, sure, it's fine. Welcome, Justin. Thank you. Did I play a land this turn? I'm trying to remember. Probably uh, not, because you have Fibble Tip, so you wouldn't have played a card before you attacked. Yeah, that's a good point. Actually, I did, because I definitely stripped mine the Rogue's Passage, and that went. All right. Um, well, Steven, that wasn't what I wanted to have happen. Well, I'm sure it wasn't, but... Steven didn't want his Maze of it to die. Yeah, that's... yeah, he did, though. That's my like favorite card. Uh, all right, I'm going to... I guess I'll fetch. Sounds like something's about to happen. No, I'm not going to get that. I just put all my permanents back in my hand. It's going to be no, bad. No, it's not. It's not something like that. It's okay. okay. Because um, I'm, I'm really done with that. I'm going to put Swan Song on top of my library. Um, Swan Song? I don't care for that. Is that the, only, is that the best thing? Oh, that's I guess all, the, the only thing. All, all the other stuff's exiled, yeah. Yeah. All right. I'll play Fable Foot. Draw a card. Yep. Do you have any mana left? Nope. I'm all done. All right. End of John's turn. Taking control of Jeremy's turn. Yeah. I'm gonna. Ta- I'm gonna. I'm gonna give Jeremy a one-one uh, spirit. I mean, my other option was. It like no, it's. Literally just threatened me. Uh, you, you sure did. Don't it. tell me what your role is. I'm going to take your turn and use Kindred Dominance to kill all of your creatures. Is Jeremy, basically my is gone, right? You were going to kill me if I didn't do that. No, I wasn't. Why? Well, you attacked me to four last turn. Yeah, and then I was going to start attacking Stephen. It's true. He could have attacked you and killed you last 48. turn. Forty-eight. I mean, he, you're, you might attack. You might attack me this turn. We'll see. All right. I'm going to Field of Ruin your uh, Buried Ruin before. No, he can still do it in response if he wants no. to. There's no... Yeah, do you want to do that? Hmm. Unfortunately, Mind Slaver's activation costs... I actually attack. don't want to do it in response, but I will do it in response if you make me. <laughs> well, oh, yeah, wait, I, tap, I tapped the wrong orchard. You're just going to make me uh, blow up one of my own lands, so... Oh no! It's an probably opponent probably not going to use it at all. Yeah, because it ramps it's everyone. It's an opponent controls. Yeah, I thought it was just non base land, so I'm not going to do that. Alrighty, have at it. I guess um, maybe you just send him a message with what's in your hand, like a picture of them. I know. Whatever. I know three of the cards. I mean, it, he can follow me and show us what's in your hand, but I don't get to know. That's why I'm saying. You could you could just take a picture and then send it to me, Jeremy. I'm pretty confident Good. that I'm not going to make it through this turn, so you feel free. John, I have a sneaking suspicion that uh, you're not going to make it through this turn. I'm yeah. hoping that you don't make it through. I'm hoping I, they focus I don't, on you. I don't really care about these other two. So okay. Kindred Dominance, All is Dust. Yeah, I know. Painful okay, Truths so, and Solemn. Okay, good. so it's nothing too crazy. No. Nope. Okay. So uh, the first thing that I'm going to do is cast uh, All is Dust. Actually, the first thing I'm going to do is play... Attack. No. Oh, his cell is all the void. Okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Cool. How much mana... How much lands do you have, Jeremy? Lands? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten lands. How much how mana much can you mana? make? One, with two, your, how much three, mana can you make four. with your lands and artifacts? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. If it is specifically for uh, colorless Eldrazi yeah. spells, yeah, we'll, we'll say and we'll say four we'll more say, for Smothering Tithe. And we'll say uh, that yeah, it is I have four more for Smothering Tithe. Yes. Okay, great. All right, so I'm going to cast uh, I'm going to cast Vile Redeemer with your Smothering Tithe. Three of your Smothering Tithes. Um, and then I'm going to cast all this dust with another smothering tithe and your. I'm going to draw a card. Your two, uh, your two mana doublers and then two other things. I get this because he drew a card. That's fine. All I'm right, also, so... also going to draw a card, but I'm going to pay. 
Actually, I'm not going to pay. Whatever. Why would I do that? All right. So you're going to tap your two Eldrazi lands. That's four. Uh, yeah, just tap two other things. Yep. doesn't matter. And then two other things. Yep. All is dust. Now yep. all is dust is resolved. Sure. Ugh. All right. I'm going to uh, your little your little skulker says these are scions as well. I forgot. They, yeah, yeah, that's mana. fine. They also, they also can attack. Yeah. They're also two power creatures. Yep. Um, whenever you can a creature you control deals da combat damage to a player, you may draw a card. All right, I'm going to attack John for nine, and then Steven with the rest. You you just you you figure that out. Actually, here, uh, your your ruin your ruinator guy, the three two, mm -hmm. and uh, three of the scions at John, because those are two those are two ones, right? All two right. ones, yeah. So you, man, uh, that's a bad idea, Justin. But actually, you're this take every turn he gets. Huh? It's a bad idea. Unless you're gonna take every turn he gets. So you're taking how? I'm taking nine. I'm dead. And then Steven's taking what? He's about to draw eight cards, Justin. Yeah, he is. But Justin has them. Well, temporarily, yeah. Eh, not temporarily. I, mean, how, I, I don't know how much I'm attacking Steven for, but I'm going to attack him. Uh, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, because this is colorless creatures. Okay. Because this one just came into play. Yep. I take it. All right. Draw those cards and tell me what they are, Jeremy. Five, six, seven, eight. This might. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um. Sorry, John. Yeah. No, you're not. All right. I mean, the only thing I could have just never attacked you unless you sit on your Vincer forever, but. You could just let Justin die, and then uh, that's what would happen. Three lands, Frontier <laughs> Bivouac, Savage Lands, Island. I feel like I could have right. there, I'm getting punched. Yep. Ancient Sterling. How are you going to get punched? I'm getting punished. Uh, Void yeah, Thunders. you are, because you, you didn't let Justin die. From Beyond, Forerunner of Slaughter, and Mind Raker. You're reaping what okay. you sowed, Stephen. All right. Um, From Beyond then, is uh, the... Yeah. The What's the artifact from... Worldwide. Yep, it's fine. I know what that one is. Okay, stuff, yeah. so um, how much mana? How much mana do you have with your lands? Uh, well, I haven't played a land this turn. So yeah. if you want to make, if you want to play island, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or six, seven, seven, eight, nine total. Twelve, and then so you have twelve mana because of your scions. Twelve mana because of the scions. Okay, so. How much does Mind Raker cost? Mind Raker is a 3-3 three, three to Void cost. How much does it cost? Black. Okay, so it costs four. Okay. All right. I want you to cast Ancient Stirrings and then Fail to Find. With You could cast it with a uh, Smothering Tide mana. You still have to take the top five and put them on the bottom, right? Yeah. Yeah. In put any order. Straight down. Fine. Put it, just don't, don't. Don't change the order, just put them on the bottom. Okay. Then cast Forerunner of Slaughter with not uh, the um, the ancest Path of Ancestry. With not that? Yes. Perfect. Uh, and then sacrifice, and then tap all of your land, sacrifice your last clue thing not clue yeah those and then cast uh kindred dominance and you're going to choose worm surprise i had a much better card for all that stuff but now you don't have a kindred dominance so i guess it's fine and jeremy let me see your hand before i'm past the turn okay Cool. All right. I'm going to scry during your turn. 
Put both of those on the bottom. And I'm done. I'm done with your turn, Jeremy. I have nine cards or eight cards in hand. Oh, you have eight cards in hand. I would like you to discard painful truths. All right. I will take my turn. That was awfully mean of him. Yeah, it was. Yeah, he threatened me, and then he did the thing anyway. It was, which you know, well, kind of I, what well, I, I threat. I th well, I, I, I threatened you because you didn't want to. Uh, no, no, no. You threatened me. I did. That's with true. It. Yeah, yeah. You, you said do this, or I will do that, or else. And you were like, no, I don't want to do it. And then you did the thing. That's true. That's true. I did do the thing. Uh. I need I need more life. God, you guys just have so much life. Why do you have I mean, so I, much? I just took a big chunk out of mine. That's true. Send triplets cost nine. I'll put a third of my life to be to be exact. You trust that send triplets out? Look, there's a sword of sinew and steel out here. That's true. <laughs> my general does cost uh a lot. Nine mana, though. I have it. Six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, well, all I could do is cast it and put, like, a lightning bruise on. Oh, I could put the sword on it. So. One, two, light. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, fourteen, and then this. All right, I'm going to cast Send Triplets. Jeremy, I'm sorry. I was about to say, four, I, I'm five, curious six, why you haven't gone to full screen, but you actually are still playing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I was like, what's going on? I'm at 39 life. Yeah, you are. You got all that life. You're, it's like you've been there the whole time and haven't done anything yet. Pretty much. You got, you got some resources to come back. All right. Uh, I guess I'm going to, I guess I'm going to attack Jeremy for three with lifelink. Did, did you, I, I was confused. I thought Centric was cost nine. And I see that you have seven mana tapped. It costs seven. I ta I've, I, that was my third time casting it. It costs I, four additional. I just got off the words you said. You well, said I, was, it I, was, I, was, I was wrong. It casts... Wait, no. No, I have cast it. You're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah. You're right. You just need to tap two more mana, but yeah, I mean... Fine. Okay. Tapped. Send triplets. I'll tack for I'll tag Jeremy for three with lifelink. Got nothing. All right, I'm done. Do your worst, Stephen. There's nothing to do. Why you have hasty? There's that send triplets out. I can't so blow it up. I can't. How many yeah. cards are in your hand, Justin? Five. So blow it up. Blow it up. Tack Jeremy and blow it up. <laughs> Sorry, Jeremy. It's for the greater good, though. To do I'm in last. It's fine. We're going to start with Meek Stone. I'm not saying to kill you. I'm just saying been to... so good against Jeremy last turn. With that all out attack, I just put a Meek, Meek Stone. Stone. My worm Meek can't untap. Oh, that's true. It cannot. Oh. It will cast Divine Visitation. That's pretty good. Hmm. Pretty good. Yep. That's pretty good. Well, I mean, I don't have anything else this turn. So, you're up, Jeremy. All right. Play my land. Interesting. So, I can cast your 20th colorless non artifact spell? Nope. That is not what my role was. Was. Uh, I'm going to play Herald of Kozlik. Two forward to void colors. So that's a good Colors cost one less. Uh, I will cast one. Solemn for three? Two, three. <laughs> oh. Well. Uh, four. Actually, no, I don't need one, two, three. Uh, three to cast Mind Raker. Um, I will put one of your planes back into your graveyard, Stephen, and each of you has to discard a card. Do I have another planes? Um, actually, I'm going to go ahead and cast a Fairy's Protection. 
Hmm. Yep. He just doesn't want to be around. Uh. All right. One can't possibly have been worth it, Stephen. Two. For Vince voice just from ripping my hand apart. Oh, look That's true. Well, you, he just targets you with sent triples, and you respond. Well. That's true, but then why am I discarding the card right now? Like, he's going to target me. He's not going to target Jeremy. Does it, does it matter? His hand. Uh, so... Your way is just me pitching one of these cards. Yes, but yeah. my way is also getting more value if someone decides to do something different. I just don't feel like it was going to go different. <laughs> I feel like Justin was predestined to take... To send triplets me on his next turn. Uh, I will put. Uh, do you have a basic land in exile, Justin? From all the cards that no. were exiled. No, I only had four cards exiled. Uh, I'll put the uh, chromatic lantern into your graveyard from okay. Exile, and that in just ten cards get me an Eldrazi spawn and actually complete my goal which was to return four cards from exile four mm -hmm. four i got two on stevens with the uh with the um uh which one was it the blight herder because that one gets two this one gets one and then this one gets one when i activate it Rats. why is there a tear in his eye like a <laughs> He's so proud of them. Don't remember that I have. So. And then I will pay three. Steven, do you want me to? Do you want me to? Do you want me to tell you my text you my roll now? If you want to, sure. <laughs> you, I guess you can just tell me. It doesn't really matter. And I will uh, play that from beyond. And then I will pass the turn since I have nothing else. Hold on. Hope it was to attempt to take Steven's cards and get to Fairy's protection instead. <laughs> Getting a message. Whose turn is it? Justin's? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ah, that's good. That's good. Uh, that's dire good. Director Kyle good. Director Kyle, you can you can bring my you can bring my roll back. You yeah. can bring my roll up on screen. The fact that I sniffed it out but I didn't really home in on it. As oh. as I have not as I've not been able to complete it. Hmm. <laughs> No, no, no! I won't fall for it. I, You're not I, gonna get mine before. But you. I did. But I did get yours, Stephen. You said five. No, I said. Uh, but after you did that, then I said six. That didn't count. You said six as I was casting the six equipment. No, I cast when you said five. Come I on. got two. I got. John, it, 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 I guess John. If you say it as I'm doing it. Like I'm lining up four of them, and then well, I cast the fifth one, and you're like, I, five, yeah, six. First of all, it doesn't, it doesn't, <laughs> that doesn't count. Get out of here. It doesn't. It doesn't matter because I didn't get Jeremy's. I never was going to get Jeremy's. He need, he nope. had to tell that, me well, that that one was just, tricky. Specifics of it because we. I'm cast gonna it. I'm gonna scry two. So in my deck tech, I actually did say uh, after I received that, I was like, oh man, I have to think of like you know. Uh, pull from I, eternity rift sweeper. Yeah, pull, That's where I would go. Pull, pull from eternity rift sweeper. The first two, and those are like some of the only ones. And then I was like, oh wait, blinking brings it back from exile. Hey, Kyle, I want to blink things. And he was like, That's not really in the spirit of what and I was like, ah, fine. <laughs> uh Jeremy, you can get a you can get a little fellow. I'm gonna flat cast uh enlightened tutor. Yeah. I don't really you want to give no you can't give Stephen a four. I can't I can't give it to Stephen actually. Can't give Stephen a four four angel. Or is it just when you your stuff, Stephen? If one or more creature tokens would be created under your control. All right, yeah. yeah I, don't under would, I don't think he would have gave it to me anyway. I'm gonna get shark typhoon. Oof. Yeah. Well that's a good card. Well I gotta kill uh, is, uh, I'm gonna struggle to win the game. So Well, you might not get any cards because I don't know that Jeremy has anything other than a solemn. You know what I have? It's solemn and two lands. So he can oh, cast okay. the solemn and go get another basic solemn. land out of his. And I can play a land. I mean, he's eventually going to get cards out of my hand, but he's not going to get them right now. All right. I'm going to untap. I'm going to target Jeremy with Centro, but I'm going to draw this 
Savage Shark, Lands Shark or Frontier Typhoon. Bivouac? You have one mana of... Yeah, worm, the Worm doesn't untap. The Worm does not oh, yeah. Good call, good call, good call. It's very meek. Well, the rest of the stuff does, right? Mm. Playing, yeah, the, playing the fight Typhoon. How many Shark Tuckers do you have? I don't know. I'm gonna play the I'm gonna play the Shark Typhoon. You're about to find out. To be fair, I don't I don't uh, think I blame him for for not having multiple Shark Typhoons. Uh, I do you have Savage Lands, which has Savage a, Lands and Frontier Bivouac. So you've got a black I'll play, or a I'll, blue. Dumb. I'll play the Bivouac. Okay. I don't think you get two lands from Jeremy. Because <laughs> you never drew them. That's true. You wouldn't have took lands out of my hand anyway. So well, I wouldn't you, just, you would have just, just made a land draw. Yeah. yeah. yeah you made a land. Um, Solon doesn't make a yes. worm, does he? Does not. Does not. Uh, I'm going to play Ghostly Prison, and then I will make a 3-3 three, three shark. Sure enough. Three three. Yep, just just big enough to not be able to to untap. Okay, I am done. Pass to Steven's turn. It's not gonna cast that Solomon yours. He's got something tricky. No, I, I actually really just need a Castle Vantress because the two cards in my hand aren't going to do it, and neither is Solemn. Well, well, he says. Steven, you gonna get to attacking? You're over there playing a bunch of equipment. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna open the armory. I'm gonna open the armory. Yep, I'm still open not attacking. I don't know if we're attacking yet. I have to go look for something. I don't remember if I included it, and right now I need it. Take your time, though. Take your time. I'm just looking through the whole deck real quick. Jeremy, I can't believe you killed John so fast. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We'll take a basilisk collar. That's the one. Uh, <laughs> That's the, the one. That's the one. I'm looking for, I didn't include. So it literally doesn't matter what I get. I can only get equipment. There are no ours. So I just don't want to lose a point for searching. I chose the, the one in front of me. Once that's not there, I'm so dumb. I wish you guys could have just heard what I heard, but that was crazy. I opened Magic Online for the first time, and it sounds like the theme to Jumanji. (laughs) 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 Probably for Zendikar Rising, I got it. I'm going to cast Remus. Yep. Hey, yo. I'm going to get a hasty. It's gonna be hard to equip things. You know what? I am gonna, I am gonna equip. All right, I'm gonna respond. Ha! Told you he had something. Oh, I knew he had something. Who's getting the token? Uh, Jeremy will get the token. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna cast Sublime Epiphany. I'm going to uh, bounce Brimaz. I'm going to draw a card, and I'm going to make a copy of this shark. And you make a 6-6 shark. And I make a 6-6 shark. Justin, I'll, I don't think I can win from here, and he's just going to do nothing but make sharks. And well, that's, with well like I said, well, that's why I got the shark thing, because I said I got to win. I have to have a way to win. Oh, uh, you could have won with our cards. I've been trying. So I haven't been trying to win with your cards. That's why I uh, didn't let you have my turn last turn. It's going to be just as bad this turn. This All right. Done? Yeah. I don't know why you're in what are you, What are you asking me, him for? <laughs> just I forgot, completely just, count just, yeah, yeah, they just like John, I forgot, I forgot you were in the, the game. game. Yeah, just counts right. me out. I would say if there's some way for you to do 15 damage, you should do it, Jeremy, but I, I'm sure that... Through a ghostly prison. And three sharks. Yeah, I'm sure. Probably not. Do you have Eye of Ugin? 
That's a good card. That is a good card. That normally uh, in an Eldrazi deck will find a way. It? That all is death back somehow. I am going to play Solemn for one. Why are you playing it for one? Ivogan and his heroine. Two yep. That's one. I think it just works for colorless spells. Yeah, Eldrazi didn't going... exist then. Oh, no, this is colorless Eldrazi spells. You're right. Oh. Yeah, no yeah, way. It, was, it was before Eldrazi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First off, Ivogan would just be banned. Yep. Okay, everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. Everywhere. The card just didn't do anything when it came out, right? But I can play Shrine of Forsaken. It searches God, so. for colorless creatures. Yeah, okay. searches for colorless creatures. Yeah, it's like there's no way that card would. <laughs> but I'm going to go look for a land. And it is banned, Steven. I'm talking about in every format. <laughs> I guess standard, it wouldn't have got banned because there weren't artifacts, but. Um, yeah, Justin. I'll let you play bunch. free thorns and free spheres. Well, only one free. I think that's all that matters. <laughs> you know, John, the fact that you can play any of them for free, that's really all that matters. Well, Workshop lets you do that. It's not banned. That's, that's true. That's true. Um, but, you know, workshop... <laughs> that's, no. that's, that sure is an argument, John. <laughs> and you can have four workshops. You can only have one eye of Ugin. Uh, not vintage. In play. Uh, yeah. It is a legendary land. <laughs> you got me there. Um, but I got no argument. You're right. Workshop's really good. What you doing, uh, J J Jeremy? You getting, well, uh, getting the spell? You getting the one you need? Uh, no. Because okay. yeah. then uh, Justin just looks at my hand and casts it. Well, you have to make sure you can cast whatever it is you get. You know. Well, I, it does cost seven to search my library. Yep. So, oh. okay, well, it's bad for us. I control target player during that player's next turn. So let's say, Director Kyle, I were to target Jeremy and I were to control him, and I were to search his library for forty-five minutes. <laughs> I'm leaving if that's what happens. That's dirty pool. Personally, would vote that the person who gets the negative point is Justin because Several. Justin's doing the searching. Many yeah. negative points. Many, you wouldn't see many. You're doing the searching, Justin. That's the way it is. I was just asking. Okay, well, just a just an innocent question innocent. with no basis in reality. Question. Uh, I'm going to attack Stephen. Oh. Two, well, four, I mean, you might as well get second. <laughs> five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, for eight. <laughs> might as well get second. Yeah, I take eight. And then I pass the turn. All right. So why did you bounce on Bremen? It's like, what? who can I even attack? No, I didn't want you to get the angel. That was really what it was. Who can I even attack? I don't With know. Sacrificing Bremen in the attack. I don't know. And he doesn't care. That is also true. I don't know and I don't care. Here's Would you like a land? No, I got a target, Steven. Who would have guessed? I need to cast some spells. All right. Well, um, it's the same spells I've had in my whole game. Yeah. And a sword of war and peace, a sword of body and mind, a colossus hammer and a basis. I'm a. How much mana is all that? To cast it all? Nine. Eight, eight, eight to cast it all. Even better. This is why he shouldn't have attacked me, Jeremy. I tried to warn you. Why he, ain't gonna, he ain't gonna attack me and lose him. Well, the option is he doesn't attack or he attacks you. Yeah, but again, he's not going to attack me and lose the equipments. Okay, so then he gets the equipment and attacks me anyway. Yeah, that's the point I was trying to make. Okay, so, so my anyway. options were attack you or just don't attack, and in either case, I'm still taking a bunch of damage, is what I'm saying. That is exactly what it was, yes. No, you look, you look the dragon. So you, you're telling me... You look the dragon you're, in the face. You're, you're telling me... <laughs> <laughs> to not punch my ticket to the punch club. That's what I'm here. No, I'm telling you, to, out of just, spite, just, to attack Justin. Just week to week, you're just flip flopping on your I on your punch club I uh, you opinions punch. here. Just punch Justin. I can't punch Justin because he has a uh, a bunch of blockers. Well, I mean, you have and, and ghostly blockers. prison and ghostly prison, which would well, cost me all this mana. What'd you do? All right. with? I've cast all of these. All right. Now, awesome. uh, the only one you can't really equip is the Colossus Hammer, so I'm just going to... Fine. 
somewhere I'm else. getting I'm getting more sharks, which of course you you got two three drops and two one drops. You have four sharks. So three two three threes and two one ones. You gonna start attacking? Well yeah, but I gotta manage these. I don't really know how to do it. Do you not have the infinite tokens? I got these. He's right run now. out of them. Yeah, well, he, was he, he going to start making sharks? On yeah. The I guess he that's, could, yeah. that's the whole point. <laughs> Make some sharks. <laughs> what is he going to do? Start making sharks? Yeah, yeah make, that's, make, that'll, that'll do it. That'll, make, be, make, that'll be a way to do it. Make the tokens out of the dry erase tokens? <laughs> All right. 3-3 three, three shark. Boom. I have two of these. There you go. Look at that. I have three of this one. It just takes so long. The upkeep is just. Well, whose fault is that? Three. Kyle's. So. Why do you have three one ones? Don't worry about it. Keep going. Ignore him. Whatever. Yeah. Actually, just go. Go. One one shark. Two of those. All right, that's for all of that stuff. And Steven, you have a... Retribution of the Meek, a Prismatic Strands, and a Bremasm. And what does Retribution of the Meek say? Uh, bury all creatures with power four or greater. Okay. So basically, it doesn't really do anything to you. It doesn't really it doesn't do anything, do anything to anybody. Uh, that's because you erased all his lords. I was setting Jeremy up for the Great Fall. The Vanquisher's Manor, I was like, oh man, I can put the meat stone in, and then all of it's tapped, and I can wait for him to commit more to the board, and then I can bury it! All right. I'm not going to tap this one, so one, two... What are we equipping? Three, four... You got uh, you have Body and Mind and War and Peace. Yeah, they're going to go on the the big shark. So you're making a 10-10, got you. And make it a 10 10 shark. Um, I will attack Jeremy for 10. And then I'm going to gain two. I don't know how much Jeremy takes. How many cards do you have in your hand, Jeremy? One. All right. So you're going to take 11. I'm going to gain two. And then I'm gonna make a, I'm gonna make a wolf, a two two wolf, which is gonna look a lot like this piglet. And then Jeremy's gonna mill ten. Hmm. I think I oogin before that just to make sure. So you're gonna take two then. You'll yeah. take an extra damage. Yeah, I'll take an extra damage. Okay. That's fine. So, so Jeremy takes 12. I'm going to gain 2. Jeremy mills 10, and then I'm going to get this. Three, 4, 5, 6, 7. Go look for a colorless creature spell. Reveal it, put it in my hand. Take an extra damage there. Find one of those uh, scary Eldrazi's. Yeah, like I said, I only have a couple. Man, this board. Mm -hmm. Man, this game. What are you getting, Jeremy? I am going to get this. There he is. Is it Ulamog? Yeah! It is Ulamog, the <laughs> yeah! Jeremy, can I give you this Lightning Greaves? Oh, I man, I know what you should go for with that Lightning Greaves. Yeah, that would be great. I'm going to okay. cast Prismatic Strands and make another 3-3. Three, three. Out of your hand, Steven. Yep. Um, I am done after that. Interesting. So you're saying first off, I don't like that you cast all my spells. Is your buried drone still in play? Yeah, it's still in play. Okay. We will kill your bear group. Got it. Then I have to mill 10, right? You do have to mill 10, yeah. Okay. 
cast Remus. Yep. Oof. And then um, we'll equip uh, the hammer. Yep. You got the power plant. Two other lands. Uh, Kozilek, the Great Distortion. Sword of Zeno and Steel. Yep. World Breaker. Feast and Famine, and yep. then Lightning Groups. Yep. Okay. Jeremy. Hmm. You need to take this hit, man. <laughs> I need to take <laughs> this just, hit? You just put, we need, we need put to kill 20 Central. equipment. So he's like, you need to take this hit, man. We need, we need to kill <laughs> let, me, let me punch you in the face <laughs> really punch hard. Punch you in the face real hard. And then on your turn, you're gonna swing it. You need to take this. No. Hit. You could have, he could have just put. He could have just put the sword of sinew and steel on it. And he loads it up, and he's like, "Listen, Jeremy, this is the only way." I, well, I mean, you don't. I'm gonna attack you. You don't have to take the hit, but you should take. It. <laughs> and for the record, I'm just hitting you back for exactly what you just hit me for. Oh, how man. much? Ten. Oh, uh, three, four, five, six, seven. That's it. <laughs> You know what? Just hit me in the face, Steven. Just <laughs> oh, wait. I'm wide. It's nine. It's nine. Just can... punch me in the face. Uh, how many cards are in your hand? Two. Oh, I'm not bad because you have to discard one if I hit. <laughs> Go ahead. I'm gonna attack you. You can block or not block. I don't care, man. There's that savage land. There's right. that we'll savage land. We'll, we'll attack. Okay. Now the question is, Jeremy, <laughs> do I cast this retribution of the meat to kill his giant shark? But it's, oh, uh, <laughs> Centripetus is dead, dude. Where's Hold on. Place? Where's your 4 4 flying it, angel? I'm about to put it into play. That's it's also attacking. attacking. It's it attacking, has to be uh, attacking Jeremy, too. <laughs> it's attacking. That 6 6 flying shark? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to attack him with that. Uh, uh, <laughs> no, 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 I can attack Justin, right? You can attack Justin with your 4 yeah, 4 I'll attack Justin with it. I I'll, don't want to attack Jeremy with it. I'll, I'll double block. I'll, one of my sharks will die. Yeah, it's dead. Get it out of here. <laughs> John is just dead. I have, I have four of these. Yeah. I four have, of these three threes. I don't want to attack him. All right. Laughing oh, so loud, Malcolm got excited. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm done. I'm finished now. All right. Oh man. Oh. That was, <laughs> that was, John is just done, yeah. This just blink that out, director. Can I just <laughs> Sid Triplets is over here. Yeah, I gotta get another point this way. Look. I'm gonna yeah, put back this, what's going on then? I'm, I'm gonna put this Seagate re reborn <laughs> into play tapped. You don't wanna Seagate, draw one? See, yeah, that's not drawing one doesn't seem like a good idea right Seven now. Seven mana. Um, yeah, so it's, uh, two less, and then one less, so seven mana. Let's do this. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven Path of Ancestry, so that I can scry Ulamog, the Ceaseless Hunger. Which is going to exile Shark Typhoon and uh Well, one of the swords, Jeremy. Yeah. Sort of gonna be real re able to re equip them. Whichever one gains you life, I don't I don't care. Okay. Well War and War peace. War and peace. Okay. Gains him one live, one card. You have no cards again. I don't. I don't. It doesn't matter. One of the swords doesn't is fine. doesn't gone anymore. Any sword. Um. Oh, I got another Eldros. Not that it matters. I mean, Jeremy, if you feel the need to just attack me back again, by all means, go for it. <laughs> Jeremy, you're gonna need to take this hit. <laughs> I mean, that's just, uh, he did. He took the hit, like I said. He's, I uh, appreciate it. <laughs> took it like a champ. I'm willing to take on right back on the chin, you know? Oh, man. Two. Oh, God, Speaking of which, high. what actually happened to that, to that for, for Flying Angel, Stephen? I, bl I double blocked it. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Two, five. <laughs> I can 
completely forgot about that. 13 at you, Steven. Oh, 13 at me! I will block something. Will you? Oh, you do have a Grim Master. I think I'll block Oh, your yeah. Solemn. I'll block your Solemn. Just. Okay. <laughs> and take the rest of it. Just do So it. you're going to take 11. <laughs> yes, then I'll block Solemn. There you go. He didn't even have blockers this Ooh. time, Jeremy. What are you doing? He Ooh. had a 2-2, two, two, some 1-1s, one, 1-3-3. One, three, three. Do it, Jeremy. I have, I have eight creatures, eight untapped said, creatures. a lot, so four, I'm three, doing three. something good. This might actually do something. One, two, three, four, uh, five, six. I'm going to well, play Jeremy. Drowner of Hope. Whenever Drowner of Hope enters the battlefield, put two 1-1 one, one colorless Eldrazi Scion tokens onto the battlefield. They have sacrificed this. Sacrifice an Eldrazi Scion tap target creature. No, it's, it's probably not. But... Jeremy, did, did you attack me last turn? He just you attacked me just I now. I just yeah. attacked you. you, just, can, you can't can... attack Hold on. He can't attack me for all that. Why? Why not? Throw this creature to the Unless, unless they're two or less. Right? They are they're all two or less. less. They're all tiny. Yeah, we're yeah. fine. I can't, My, it's really hard for me to lock. I, I, yeah, they're all I tiny. didn't cast Mind Raker, or I didn't attack you with Mind Raker because it was okay. three, but it's whatever this time. So, Drowner of Hope. That's that's what we're doing there. There you go. Pass. All right. All right, my turn. Yeah. I'm helping everybody out. I'm giving Justin an extra point by killing his 10 triplets. Yeah, yeah. I'll draw. All I right. Such terrible draws left in my deck. Can you attack and mill me? If it kills you. It won't kill me. Oh, actually, he probably can kill me. Oh, actually, ha ha ha, glad I blocked. It's true. Also, is blocking. Yeah, well, it blocked the 2 2, so. I'm going to play Ember Cool the Promised End. How dare you? What does that have to do with finding out our roles? So Jeremy, he, or Justin just felt like uh, mind slaving everybody. Now he's going to mind slave. Uh, I think it's going to be Jeremy this time. It's going to be Jeremy. I think it's Jeremy again. Yeah. The old double wine slayer. Yeah, super, super fun. Yep. Just like I'm scrooged here, Jeremy. Uh, then I'll play Firemind's Vessel. I'm just going to bring this all back to when Steven decided the generous gift. Yep. He needed that extra point. Just He just needed it. Well, what's the difference? What if I knew I you have any, you, uh, I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go to combat. Says Justin would have been dead. Well, Justin should remember that. I'm gonna go to combat. But he uh, doesn't remember that. It looks like he's trying to kill me instead of Jeremy. I'm gonna go to combat. I'm gonna allow it. I know I wasn't talking to you. He's asking you know if you're drowning or hoping. Just hit me in the face. There you go. Got it. Tech you for 14, Jeremy. 14? Yep. Come on. Hit me. Stop trying to hit me I, and hit me. I literally cannot kill you. You can kill me. He has, a, kill he has me. a worm there. He's a liar. He, but he has a million blockers. He has a piggy and a worm. You have yep. a... So you tell me if, if I attack you with those two, you just wouldn't block and you just die? Because I don't I, believe I you. I think that's what I, he's telling you. I feel like I would rather just die outright than have you take my next turn again. <laughs> It's okay. There's a turn in between. Maybe I stop him from taking your next turn. All right, I take 14. That's true. Yeah, you, if you kill him, I don't get his next turn. That's true. That's exactly what I was thinking. Now I'm done. Hmm. 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 Interesting. Interesting. We shall cast. Retribution of the meek. Bury all creatures with power four or greater. I'm indestructible. It doesn't count. So just, oh, that's yeah. okay. I thought it yeah. was. Yep. It's it was just my shark and Emrakul. Yep. And Brimaz, but it's indestructible. Yep. The angel's gone. The angel is gone. It is. It took a trip. Why did I think Drowner of Hope was bigger than it is? It's a five-five. It's dead. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay, I was like... I... Is it? Oh. Yeah, you're yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. 
And then we're going to play a true conviction. Sure. Take six. Yeah, I was trying to read it because I have a true conviction. Double strike and the lifelinks. Yeah. We'll go to attackers. Uh, I missed. You can only attack one person. I uh, messed up, yeah. Maybe. Now the angel can attack. Yeah. The angel, angel, doesn't care angel can, attack, can attack Jeremy and kill him. We'll can also attack you. Uh, you can, yeah. Yeah, but I have to kill Jeremy, so we'll attack Jeremy with both of them. Okay, super dead. All right, wait, wait, wait. You, where are you blocking? He didn't. So he takes. I can block the Ulamog on the Brimaz, and then I still take four in the air, right? Yeah. You do. I'm just. I'm gonna gain the life anyway, right? Yeah, you're gonna gain yeah, the you're life. Gonna, you're gonna gain the. Well, you're gonna gain the life. Shot. Oh, because you have no, the gain both. swords, though. They're all gonna. Uh, yeah, trigger. I'm gonna just that's... block with Ulamog then. You still, you still gain the life. No. Well, you gain the first strike damage. I gain 13. Why doesn't he gain the other damage? He'll be dead from first strike damage. What? No, Jeremy doesn't die from first strike. He dies from the angel. Which has first strike. Oh, yes, true conviction. Yeah, you're right. Double strike and lifelink, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I'll gain 13. Did you gain four from the angel? Yeah. Okay. Nine from Brimaz and four from the angel. Got it. And Jorgo. All right. Uh, these do not untap. The one one sharks untap. Yep. Okay. Uh, my lands are gone. Your lands are gone. I hope that hurts. No, nah, it doesn't really. God, I, think it did. <laughs> I said I hope, Justin. Okay. How much does it cost to equip that hammer? Eight? Ten? I think it's ten, right? Uh, yeah. I'm going to tap six. I'm going to play Sharoom the Hegemon. I don't know what that does. It returns an artifact, which is going to be Mind Slaver. Bye-bye, Steven. Does it do it every turn? No, just once. Uh, kind of. Where there's a will, there's a way. There's not. There's not, a, there's not the will, though. No. Mm-mm. I'm going to sacrifice Mind Slaver, so I'm going to take control of Steven's next turn. Um, I will go ahead and equip this sword of body and mind to Shroom. And Basil's Caller is two to equip. Yeah. I'll do that also. And then I'm done. Hey, Steven, look. It's Justin's turn. All right, what you got? Planes. Is that, is, you don't have any cards in your hand? No. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna flashback prismatic strands tapping your brimaz. That's how that works. Uh, you can yeah. Uh, and then I'm going to um, attack me with the angel, and I'm gonna block with Sharoom and then gain seven life. Right. You'll pay two mana. Sharoom's dead, right? Angel has double strike. So, the, yeah, 4-4 four, four double strike. Sure, they're both dead. That's fine. I'll still gain 7. Yeah. Steven will gain 8. Steven will gain 8. Alright. Then I'll take my turn. Not playing the land, right? Keep it in my hand. No, nah, you can keep the land. Yeah. Okay, those sharks don't untap. So I have these three creatures that are untapped. Alright. I will draw one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'll play send triplets for the fourth time. Um, I'll put uh, the sword. These sharks are one ones. I'll put the sword on a shark. And I'll attack you for uh, three 
four, five, six. Got some good cards. Some of them I can't use. You got a Sword of Light and Shadow, a Signet, a Grim Marleth, a Jitte, a Condemn, and a Skull Flame. That's pretty good. All right, then I get a then I get a wolf. Yep. Then I'm done. What? Uh, six. just six. Well, I'm gonna cast uh, harsh mercy. And so whenever something hits you, it gets a gold counter. Each player chooses a creature type. Destroy all creatures that aren't of the top chosen this way. They can't be regenerated. Okay. So we each choose. Yep. I Do choose first. Do I choose first? Yes. I choose mm -hmm. Angel. Uh, I'll choose Cat. <laughs> all right, all your creatures now. Yeah. Smart. Cute. Play my land. Uh, your turn. Everything's gone. Everything. All my sharks. Justin, I'm trying to end the game. Why couldn't you just let that happen, keep a creature, and let me put my cat in the command zone? Come on, man! These are dead. Look, all right, I'm going to scry one. I'll put this on the bottom. I will eventually find another creature, Justin. 13. What, what, should, I, should I just concede, Stephen? What do you want me to do? I will. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Send triplets. Yep. Pass. Uh, or I'll keep drawing lands. Anointed procession. <laughs> Europe. All right. You have, any, you have any lands in your hand? No, I have nothing. Okay. All right. I'll play Thespian Stage. And uh, I'm going to play both of these out. So for 10. <laughs> Spear and Norn's Annex. Okay. Yep. That's what they were. And then I'm going to attack him now. I'm going to equip uh, Sword of Body and Mind and Bastless Collar on Sin Triplets. Then I'll attack you for five, mill you for ten, and make a wolf. We got. That. They're gone. Keep we're going. Good. You're we're good. good. Jump. Yeah. Then I'm going to put the Sword of Body and Mind on the, the wolf. Yep. All right. Go ahead. I drew a land, you're up. All right. That is an untap. Untap draw. I'll play a land. I'll put the... Oh, I can just... I can sacrifice this. Draw three cards. I'm going to sacrifice this. Draw three cards. Pretty good. Nope. You'd be wrong. Theoretically, theoretically, it was good. Steven, I'm going to attack you. Yep. Make another wolf. Already milled the 10. Okay. Um, I'm going to cycle irrigated farmland. Draw. And I will equip uh, this here. And then I'm done. What are you at, Steven? 25? So it took I attacked four. for four. I think Steven's done. I think I'm just going to have a scoop. Yeah, I don't. How many cards do you have in your library? Um, Nineteen. So it's two attacks. Two attacks. Well, you have, you have... I don't. I don't. I'll tell you what. I'm going to cigar to say. Sure. Uh, yep. It doesn't do anything. I thought it let me search so I could tell. Nope. Nope. No. Doesn't do anything. 
you win. I mean, we can sit here and let you attack me twice. Well, yeah, well, the thing is, even if you draw a creature next turn and you make all that stuff, all I have to do is attack. I don't even, you don't even, it doesn't have to connect or, well, it does have to connect, but. Yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I have a creature set. So. Okay. I would just, I'm going to scry. When I say I don't think I have a creature, I don't have a creature. That's fine. I'm going to, I'm going to draw Dance of the Mance. There you go. And then get back. Yeah, enough. All, all of these. Good yeah. game, you wins. All right. Well, I can't say that was my proudest victory. No, you, you're scum. Mind slaver, scum. We'll just, we'll just add it to the, to the wall of scum, like Steven said. Yeah, the wall of scum. Two mind slavers, ten triplets. You cast more equipment that game than I did. Okay, maybe not, but you cast a lot Close. of equipment. I just cast yours a bunch. Yeah, you cast a lot of my equipment a bunch. I was, uh, once, I, I didn't know what you were playing until we sat down, and once I saw you were playing Sin Triplet, I was actually really worried. Because I just wanted to see how the other side lived. You, you, you can cast every card in my deck. Not in their decks, but literally every card in my deck was. Okay. Actually, I could cast every card in everyone's deck because John had a lot of artifacts. He was also playing blue. You were playing white. Turns out Jeremy playing. was playing a bunch Jeremy's of Jeremy's was playing a bunch of colorless cards. Yeah. Colorless five color cards. Yeah. Yep. So kind well, of you need the out. actual mana for a lot of the stuff on Jeremy's side. Like you need the yeah. uh, stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah, I think this like it's an interesting deck. I like it as a concept. I don't think it's gonna win a lot of games, but it's gonna be fun. Yeah. I lost them all meek stone. Yeah. You yeah. did. Happens. I was like, I was like, he's not gonna remember that prismatic strands. Well, I did remember it, but I was saving it <laughs> to, to get locked out. <laughs> you know, honestly, to get locked out, yeah. Well, I wasn't anticipating getting locked out that way. <laughs> well, yeah. of course, no one puts Meek Stone in their deck, and they're like, "I'm gonna load up my commander with all these, and I'm then I'm gonna tap it." I, what the reality of the situation is, I never had a chance to really cast it, and it hurt. Like an angel you could just tap. No, like that's not. I, I had to get it in the graveyard first. He cast it out of my hand and then he tapped. Yeah, there's like several. Yeah, like, I just had yeah. to use that for just. Yeah, he could just cast it. Yeah, and then what's his flash? He would have cost no mana. Yeah, he would have got it. Anyway. I would just send. Yeah. He cast it. It doesn't matter. I don't, I don't think so, but it's okay. <laughs> You could just pay three and then flashed it and then been gone and not worry about it. But yeah, here we are. Whatever. Whatever. I don't think I was worried about him taking my turn again after the uh, after I killed his barrier. Room. So, but then again, I thought his role was to guess our roles and not take other people's turns. I guess that yeah. wasn't his role, but he'd already built the deck by then. So, well, we got more roles next week. Got more roles next yeah. week. Uh, we'll get well, four more rolls. Everyone will have a new role. So, so know your role. Know your role. Know your role. I won't have to know everyone's roles next know week. Your role. Oh, oh okay. Justin, I still see you trying to snoop and get the information. I'm glad oh. I didn't tell you. I'm really glad I didn't tell you. Actually, you could have taken the when day. I when I sent Justin a message, it was just you already you, know. You know already know. Yeah. <laughs> that was my message. Well, yours was. I, I want to. Yeah. Obvious is mine, and that I clearly had to do something with equipment. But it's like once I saw the plate, I was like, He's "Mine was a little more obvious." Yeah, yeah, you had to play Fibble Tip. Kyle yeah. gave it to you. Yeah, one plus my, two. My equipments were uh, Imperial Plate, Black Blade Reforge, uh, Rune Chanter's Pike, which would have been awful against Ashiok. Um, <laughs> yeah. Fibble Tip the Soul. Okay. Yeah, it was real swole. Dude, look at, he looks like a cobra with his like his back muscles all swollen. I don't think he does. I don't think he yeah, does. Yeah, he does. He got the hood of a cobra back there. Look at them. Nope. Look at nope. him. Look at him. It's ridiculous yeah. is what it is. Ah. All right. If you are on Twitter, use hashtag CMDRVS, hashtag Commander Versus to join in the conversation. And of course, you can follow us at Jeremy Knoll, at JPernell1, at Redneck Wins, at A Natural Death, and at DIR Kyle West. Hashtag scoops if you're missing the point screens. And for those of you that are still submitting them, that is where you can see them, a.k.a. where the red fern grows. Still doing A-plus work, as always. If you are on YouTube, you can like, comment, share, subscribe, and binge every week. Again, we appreciate your feedback. Feel free to keep it coming. What's seven? 
things. I don't know. Eight, eight just you know, eight things. Yep, what eight things. You can add your own on there. You know, there's a couple extra things. So you do whatever you want. Yeah. Yeah. So the Stephen Green way. Uh, and of course, we want to thank our sponsors, uh, Carnox Chairs. You can go to Carnox.com and use, or excuse me, Carnox.com slash SCG to save 10% at checkout when you purchase one of their wonderful gaming chairs, which Steven and I have. John has their uh, their budget version. No. It's just a phone seat. Phone it's the economy version. <laughs> the economy <laughs> version. Uh, and of course, we also want to thank our other sponsor, uh, Cole Less Apparel. You can go to colelessapparel.shop and use gift code SCG to save 10% off at checkout. And they have a lot of new, a lot of new stuff coming out. Um, I'm pretty excited about some of their shirts. I know John's really excited about some of the new shirts that are coming out. Yep. So I'm sure we'll be featuring those on this show soon. And of course, Star City Games Premium is $7.99 a month. You can get 15% off of supplies, 10% off of singles, and 5% off of sealed product as well as getting access to all of the premium articles uh, that go up every single weekday. So, anything sealed else, product. gentlemen? Sealed product, which includes pre-orders for Commander Legends, which you can get right now. Does. It does. As well as, as well as by the time this video comes out, I'm sure there'll be two or three more products that just are new announced. that Wizards has announced. Yeah, and you can pre-order those and too. They'll just be pre-orderable. Sure. Exactly. I, I don't feel like the last thing you said is true. You think it's more? No, wow. I just don't necessarily see that you'll be able to pre-order them yet when this comes out. Oh, well, okay. Maybe. They'll be announced, they'll be announced <laughs> for like announce them, December but or, you know. We got pre-orders up for it or not. It's a bit we're we're going to try really hard. <laughs> okay. Anyway, uh, but I think that's it. We'll be back next week with week two of Hidden Rolls. And uh, any anybody have anything else before we head out? Uh, you can find me on twitch.tv slash Jeremy Knoll Mondays and Saturdays playing Paper Commander. 8 p.m. Eastern. Boom. What? Boom. Boom. Tough acting to acting. Every time they say my name, I show up in chat. It's true. That did happen last time. Don't Just you know you summon him? I, have I, to be I said, in Jeremy's channel, and he starts talking about me. I'm like, oh, yeah, and I was like, no, that sounds like a deal that Stephen Green would make. And then he just, I have been summoned. It was great. <laughs> All right, that is it this week for Jeremy Knoll, for John Suarez, for Stephen Green, for Director Kyle West. I'm Justin Parnell. See you folks next week.